Ooh. Well, hello! Welcome to Monster of the Week! Woohoo! Yay! Um, this week on Monster of the Week, uh, we have just finished up last week's uh, mystery. Well, last, last mystery. Um, and uh, are going into a sort of downtime session between this mystery and next. Um, last mystery has uh, involved our uh, main three heroes. Uh, well, heroes is a genuine, gen, uh, generous, generous term. Um, but <laughs> our, our main three uh, protagonists, um, mm -hmm. Spooky's going through, uh, who I've been lovingly calling, um, uh, uh, was it Misery Incorporated in my head? Um, they didn't <laughs> know the just now. Um, but they they have um, they have gone to a museum where there were reported uh, strange happenings, uh, only to find uh, the ritual the process of a ritual beginning and children going missing, uh, being trapped inside this weird little pocket dimension of the museum. They fought their way around trying to figure out what was happening, uh, ultimately coming to face to face with uh, a large uh, uncanny entity. Having a, having a good snack, or <laughs> <laughs> um, with a large, large, uncanny entity. <laughs> um, uh, as various deals were made, uh, children were saved, uh, and one cursed and doomed to forever be uh, a spooky little girl. Um, after uh, winning, maybe? Uh, who's, who could say? Uh, they were set free from this little pocket dimension uh, and released back into the normal world, um, where exhausted and in the middle of the night they went back to their hotel all except one charlie who made his way to a payphone to call his sister right and that's what happened <laughs> wait what happened in the call um charlie went um so i'm supposed to kill god not be god and then she went oh my god charlie and he said how are you doing sis and i was like that yeah oh. yeah yeah that was a uh, that's the pog. That's that's I what happened. Gore. For gore. That's why we're here for the rem rem reminding remembrance thing. We are all remembered. We're yeah. we're so remembered. Um. Now you may notice something different about this week, uh, which is we have a new a new little guy joining the party. Mm -hmm. Salvi, would you like to say hello? Just a Mr. little guy. Just hearing a little guy. Um. Their character introduction will come up in a couple minutes. Um, however, just it's fun and cool to have. Uh, I think that's all the bookkeeping out of the way. So let's let's monster some weeks. <laughs> yeah. Let's all be weekly monsters. Um, weeks some monsters. No, no, I changed my mind. I want to be daily creature. <laughs> okay, I I have a question to start you guys off. Um, do you want to have a little baby time skip where you have all agreed to travel to meet up with Charlie's sister, or do you guys want to have that conversation in character? Uh, um, I can do conversation. I do not care. It would be kind of random that, like, when suddenly we know about his sister. Sure. Sounds good. Um, okay, so Charlie, you have, uh, finished up your conversation with your, with your sister in this payphone, um, where you've told her about how you have some weird things concerning your destiny. Um, she's made some sort of weird half-hearted apology uh, for abandoning you those couple weeks ago, um, and instead decides uh, to give you a full explanation of what happens uh, when you guys meet up, which she is asking for help, uh, as she has found something that she finds to be very interesting and perhaps related to you. Um, you are, are done with this phone call. Um, unless you have more to say, uh, would you like to make your way back to the motel? Yeah, Charlie says his uh, goodbyes and um, uh, tells her to take care in the meantime, and then Charlie heads back to uh, the motel, M motel, motel to hang out with uh, uh, Ariel and Kai. So Charlie well, enters the motel. What are you guys up to? Are you are you sleeping already uh, in the bathroom? What's happening? Uh Ariel doesn't sleep, but she's kind of trying to get contact with Annie. She's a okay. little freaked out about that whole business. Sure. Uh, currently, you still do not feel her. Um, you feel like a trace of her, but it's very weak. Hmm. Well, she's 
she's concerned about that as much as she Understandably. can. And then she notices um, Charlie. Charlie and she... looks at Ariel and goes, Sup. <laughs> what is that? Um, it is a question. Sup means what is up. Oh. So how are you doing? Well, apparently there is a lamp on the roof. Um, how are you doing? Oh. Well, I do not know where Annie is. Um, that's concerning. Yes, she, I can't sense her anymore. There's only a slight trace of her. Um, is that normal for, like, angel possession? Well, I've never possessed anyone before, but I don't know. I might ask my superiors about this. Yeah, that could be good, because otherwise, um, it's probably a safe bet that, um, a big old, old ugly yellow colored, I don't know, god thing is probably behind it. Oh, wait. No, I, I yeah. Probably forgot his name. <laughs> uh, by the way, uh, I picked the, um, boss from, be from beyond thing. Okay. Um, uh, let me see what that does. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Just thought I'd inform you about it. It's a good information to have, thank you. You're welcome. What is Kai doing also? Oh. Uh, if you want to know about Kai, he is, like, asleep on the bed with the cover over him as if he was in, like, a mortuary, like, a dead guy. <laughs> Oh my God. I love him. Does, does, he have, does he have the like half open mouth like a dead person too? He's under the sheet. You'd have to pull out, uh, like open the sheet. Oh tonight. my God! Oh, I see, I see, I see. I bet um, we could see like the silhouette. <laughs> Charlie, Charlie starts poking him in the face, like over, like at the sheets, basically poking the face until Kai moves. And if Kai doesn't move, he just keeps doing it for like half an hour. Kai is a heavy sleeper. You'll be there all night. <laughs> what is it? I guess you hmm. could say he's deeply sleeping. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. Was, that was, that was really, really good. Deep no, sleep. Way too good oh my god. How <laughs> <laughs> uh, fucking damn it. <laughs> I'm so proud of you, Mia. That was actually perfect. I didn't think it was that um, good. Mia so is perfect. Mia is perfect. Oh um, no. She even her flaws are like little instances of perfection. What is Charlie doing? Charlie uh, sits next to Ariel and be like, "Well, um, in any case, um, I do have cool. what." She asked, where did you go? Oh, well, actually, this is about that. Um, you mind if we take a little detour tomorrow? Um, I have someone I would like you guys to meet. Oh, who is that? Um, well, family, I guess. Can he be more vague right now? <laughs> <laughs> I think he's trying to be vague. Yeah. Are yeah. We Charlie is being vague. Your entire family? No. Um. Just one. Oh. Just um. Just one. one. Um. I don't really want to talk about it too much, but Why? um, it can't really be helped. So um. Oh. We'll we'll discuss it more tomorrow. Um, I understand. Just um, yeah. Family my... can be complicated. <laughs> Tell me about it. My family is also complicated. 
Yeah, how does that work? Are you, like... Is it just, like, all angel, like, of one big sibling family, or, like... Leah are all brothers and sisters. Okay, so... How many are Considered you... Considered children there now? Like, of God. Aren't humans also children of God? Or is that, like, a different yeah. abbreviation of children of God? We are all his children. Well, that's one hell of a messed up, like, level of incest, I guess. And then Charlie goes to sleep. Oh my god. <laughs> incest. Uh, and with that, um, you all take a well-deserved rest, uh, healing off your wounds and all of, all of your exhaustion uh, for the next morning's trip. Um, and you make your way into the... Uh, I guess the bus, um, uh, and the you bus go to meet at the the bus stop that your sister mentioned. Um, <laughs> bussin. Um, mm -hmm. um, and okay, and you you unless you have anything to say, you arrive at the uh, at the bus stop, and you see a, an old, sort of rusty uh, pickup truck, like a like like Mater from from Cars is a, a good reference for it. Um, uh, it's just this old, <laughs> this old rusty pickup truck, um, and you can see uh, through the the front windshield um, this uh, sort of girl with like uh, ginger red hair uh, and freckles and this large burn mark across her face, uh, waiting in the truck when you arrive. Um, I guess Charlie just goes on and um, sits down like. Uh, for just in the back, and um, did Wait, Charlie get to buy a, a new a phone? Um, Wait, well, you could, a... you... it's sorry, a, it's I'm... like a flatbed. It's a flatbed truck. Flat. So it's oh. it's two seats, two You're seats flat. in the front, and then a flatbed in the back. Oh, so mean, one person can sit in the car. Surely, um... and other people have to sit in the flatbed. Yeah, Charlie like sits in the flatbed. And like pulls out his phone. He sits in the middle, and he's like, well, uh... "Daryl sits next to Charlie." Yeah. Can Charlie have a new phone? I don't know if we established that, but um, Charlie would have bought the new phone. With what money? Uh, I have like uh, sixty-nine money. <laughs> okay. So uh, uh, you I, you can have like a flip phone. <laughs> have a flip phone. Wait, it's you, you, bought, you bought a burner. Is this yeah. random truck picking us up? I think I zoned out. <laughs> uh, yeah, you, you, you were told that, that you safe. were going to meet um, Ulrich's, or, uh, Charlie's family at the bus stop, uh, and he, he just hopped in this, this truck without saying anything, so... Oh, okay. You assume. <laughs> okay. Well, Ariel doesn't really know what a bus is. Listen, Charlie just went instinctually into, like, family mode, so... Um, Kai, where are you sitting? There's a, a seat in the in the front next to um, to Charlie's sister, and there is uh, a flatbed in the truck next where Ariel and uh, Charlie are sitting. Is that so? Is there like okay? So is there like two seats available? There is one seat available. Uh, she is in the driver's seat. Okay. Plenty, plenty of room in the in the flatbed. Flatbed, if you'd like. What is a flatbed? I like flatbread. Let me hold on. I'll grab. A, I also it's like, like flatbread. It's it's um. Have you have you seen the movie Cars? <laughs> I don't remember it. Oh my goodness. Uh, it's it's essentially um. <laughs> it's like if you cut a, a car in half, so it only has the Ow. first two seats, and then the uh, the rest of the car is just a flat thing for like carrying things. It's like a it's a, a, a moving it's a truck essentially. Truck. It's yeah. a pickup truck. That's yeah. You like you put things in the bag like boxes and stuff. It's for moving large things. Yeah. So or it's like, like on, an on open. Farms, you can move like hay bales and stuff. Yeah, it's an open air kind of okay. backseat area. So Kaya's gonna lie down in the flatbed. Okay. Uh, so no one, no one goes uh, to can sit. I, with, can uh, I? Can I? Can I change my thing? Because I, I think I zoned out a little bit when you said that. Um, okay. I would. I. Can I? Can I retcon that Charlie actually did sit next to her? 
Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I was just gonna say, okay, so none of you get in there, and she's sad. <laughs> but, but like, no, okay, no, so no, you no. get in. <laughs> sorry, sorry. No. So my my brain genuinely just went like, oh, so like we're meeting like Falby now, and we're on the bus. Like I zoned out a little bit too. But I, no, uh, no, you yeah. you rode the bus to the stop where the where the truck was, and you saw. Okay. Her. Now you're yeah. trucking. You're sure, no longer it. bussing. That that makes absolute sense. Charlie gets in next to his sister. Yeah, he's not gonna okay. be like weird about it. <laughs> Wait, that's his sister. Yes. Yes. That's what. I... Yeah. Charlie still Wait. doesn't give any context. He just gets Hansi... in and sits next to her. Hansi is his sister. No. Uh, no. Uh, that's not Hansi. We, oh. We, we. I got confused. I thought it was Hansi, because I stoned on and oh. didn't listen completely. I just um, heard, like, a yeah. girl with burn mark on her face. That looks like Hansi. Nope, it's not Hansi. You will meet Hansi soon, okay. and I will have Falby describe her character. Okay, 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 okay. Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> um, so that's why I'm confused, because I thought we were being picked up by a random person. No. <laughs> Okay, so it's not your fault. Oh, we're just... all so zoned out. Okay, let's yeah. not, we, we, we okay. left. We left the bus station. We got to the the truck, right? And like, the, the sister picked us up. That's the meme, right? Yes, she was. Yeah. She was waiting at the bus stop with the car running. Um, and when you got off the bus, uh, Charlie walks into the 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 passenger side door, the shotgun, um, and then Kai goes and lays down directly in the flatbed. <laughs> Ariel wants to sit next to Charlie. Um, but since there's no seat, she sits in the flatbed as well. Next um, there to is a, a little window um, that is on the back of this like carriage uh, sort of area, so you can look in at them, um, mm. and it can be pulled down if you'd like. Hi, guys, mm. to sleep. Kai's sleeping. <laughs> Kai is always sleeping. Kai is always sleeping. Ariel right. stares at Kai. Okay. That's not creepy. Um, Char Charlie looks at uh, his um, trusty companions and then turns to his sister and looks at her reaction. Um, she just kind of like wordlessly is looking at them and then uh, looks back at you and just goes, new friends? Uh, yeah, you know. Uh, I'm a charmer. And he smiles. <laughs> Like, it gives her an awkward sure smile. he is. <laughs> and, um, and Ariel, hear them? Um, you hear muffled conversation. If you'd like to pull the, the, the little, like, window thing down, you can hear them. I don't think Ariel knows she can do that. Okay. You could, you could like, knock if you know you can knock. She just... Um, continues looking at Kai. <laughs> okay. Um... She, uh, she looks over at the friends again and goes, a special group, uh, and then uh, kicks, the, kicks the gear into drive um, and begins to drive towards this uh, sort of rickety, abandoned-looking farmhouse. Um, uh, you, you are driving through these, like, dirt roads, uh, and you can see off to the side there's, like, this sort of unkempt, sort of not-taken-care-of cornfield. It looks like this used to be a very, like, prolific like corn farm um you can see like sort of like burn marks at the edges of the field where there was probably a fire losing a lot of crop um, oh my god as, as this um this car uh continues to drive over to this house uh and no it's not your house uh, and you okay. you pull in um <laughs> You, you, uh, she pulls into this like offshoot building uh, where it's like kind of a garage um, and she hops out uh, and goes all right now I mentioned that there was something I wanted you guys to, well, I wanted you to see, um, and I'd love to meet your friends. However, this is pretty pertinent. Um, Hansi, uh, and uh, Falby, would you like to describe your character as she walks in? Oh, uh, do they walk into the house? Yeah. Uh, okay, so you probably end up seeing Hansi kind of sitting on the chair, but like, you know how Elle sits? <laughs> she's just sitting on the chair like that and stuffing her face with cake which she probably don't know where she even got that cake with like another container of cake uh next to her so she has two of them she has like long pink hair kind of frizzy a little in unkempt um wearing skirt overalls and very long sleeved uh a long sleeved shirt 
kind of black and white. Nothing on her looks like it fits her entirely. Um, you see what looks like ears, like Doberman kind of ears, kind of pointed up, flicking every once in a while. When she turns around to look at you, uh, her eyes are just red, very bright red, kind of uh, freakishly so. She has goat pupils for some reason, and her bangs are on off to the side, covering one side of her face entirely. And she has a mouthful of cake, and she just waves with one covered up, uh, covered up hand because her sleeves are so long, and she has a hard time uh, keeping them uh, rolled rolled up. She doesn't really say anything because she learned that it's too rude to uh, speak with your mouth open. Uh -huh. Charlie uh, goes, sweet, we have cake? And he runs up and he says, uh -huh. <laughs> um, so My mom walked in and I didn't hear the beginning. Did we walk into this house and find... Well, was it, find was it all of us or just Charlie? Um, well, uh, Emma walked in and left the door open, assuming you guys would follow. Yeah, Charlie walked in, sees the cake, and does the meme. Oh, uh, well, Ariel follows. Did anyone wake I don't know up, about Kai? Kai. <laughs> Ariel, I'll say, I'll say it's it's like when you're when you're a kid and you're being uh, driven somewhere, and you can like feel in very sleepy tone, like the the familiar turns of arriving at your own house. Uh, however, it's not your own house, and it feels unfamiliar. Uh, and when you come to a stop, you wake up very like groggily. Uh... Wrong. <laughs> As Charlie's like eating the cake, he goes like, So, uh, hi, I'm Charlie. Um, what's your name? Oh, is she, uh, Char um... Charlie slap, uh, I mean, Emma slaps Charlie on the back of the head and says, Don't talk with your mouth, <laughs> mouth full. Uh, but... <laughs> That's probably uh, how Hansi uh, learned. <laughs> Ariel walks up to this strange girl. And she's like, you don't look human. <laughs> you see her kind of like, shifty eyes, kind of sweating a little bit. <laughs> Just like a dog getting caught uh, rummaging through trash. <laughs> she's uh, like, oh, I don't know what you mean. Do you want cake? I have cake. Uh, she pushes the cake over. <laughs> Kai, Kai just walks up to I Ariel. Cry. And... Um, like from behind her, like rubbing his eye, like that's that's a really rude thing to say. Also, aren't we kind of all not like completely human? We have uh, uh, God, God murder, um, God possessed, um, God servant, God child. And, um, yes, I just don't understand. Do dog is... God. Dog, 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 God, bark. Yes. Is that possible? What are you? <laughs> he keeps like pointing at her, like, what are you? <laughs> like Spider Man, me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, what are you? Pointing at each other. Emma sort of sort of butts in and goes, okay, so actually about that, and then pulls out this like notebook that she has in her pocket, uh, and she starts like flipping through certain pages, and she goes, so I've been checking on Hansy for a little. while while now now initially and hold on with this just give it a second bear with me um i had initially seen the, her as a sort of like harbinger of the apocalypse uh, and and it gets better it gets better it gets better it gets better put that away put it away you surely, grumpy little man surely surely just surely just like the dog thing where he's like he pulls it out and she's like ah, no no <laughs> he like pulls it back in <laughs> Um, and she, and she goes, okay, okay. So now you don't know this about me. Um, one of the reasons why I left, and again, so sorry about that. But, um, so I'm like a little bit sensitive to people's emotions and thoughts. So trust me when I tell you, she's n g good, nice for some reason. Like. I, You're I was, trusting I was... that she's not gonna destroy everything on the fact that you're a fucking... You're a fucking empath? Are you no, kidding no, 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 me? No, 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 no,
you remember you remember the night, obviously. Our night, the thing that yes. happened. Pretty hard to forget, yes. Oh, night. What I, oh, night. It doesn't concern you right now. Sorry, Emma. Ariel is a little... No, of just... course I haven't told him. It's very private and I, I don't want to talk about it. Okay, get... Emma, get Can I start eating cake? Sure, every, everyone have cake. Hansi is okay. excited because everyone's having the cake she brought. <laughs> let's just... Okay, Emma, let's just... Uh, okay. Charlie I... walks, motions to her and walks away a little bit and lets them eat and like hang out. Okay. Hansi looks just, like, just is staring at them takes like... this moment to practice eating. <laughs> Perfect. Mmm, <laughs> cake. Um, it's it's very uh, moist. It's a good cake. Um, it tastes a little bit funky, but uh, uh, Falby, what what kind of cake is it? It's chocolate. Chocolate cake. It's chocolate cake. Chocolate. She stole it from a children's birthday party. <laughs> because of course she did. Um, but um, yeah, uh, uh, Emma Emma looks to you, Charlie, and goes, "Okay, okay. So it's not it's not just like, oh, I'm an empath. Like I understand people are sad sometimes. Like no, like it, it's like I can feel the struggle going on in your head right now. I... Being around you is painful. <laughs> you understand how much it needs. I need I need you here to okay. for to for you to be here." Kai, like, he he leans his head in between both of them and is like, what am I thinking? <laughs> uh, she you? looks at you, Kai, um, and she has this, like, sort of, like, frustrated look from when she was looking at Charlie, but she looks into your eyes, and you see, like, her face sort of goes white, um, uh, or paler than it was, um, uh, and she looks a little bit concerned. Um, and then she goes, I, I don't know, but you feel cold. Okay, cool. He goes back uh, to eating cake. Hey, um. Do you want to introduce me to your friends? Sure, <laughs> um. <laughs> uh, let's, yeah, let's, let's have the introductions in order. Um, Emma? Meet Ariel, and he points towards uh, Ariel. Mm -hmm. and, then, oh. and then she's an angel of the Lord. Uh, she will tell you that if I don't tell you. And, like uh, Christianity, Lord? I don't know. It's like some the one, like, the Lord one and God only Lord. thing. Okay, uh, all right. <laughs> and then, then we have Kai. Um, uh, I think he's my Merlin or magician or whatever. Um, he he is possessed by a, um, a, 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 a deep. I don't like. Uh, um, when you say that, uh, she was holding a, a notebook. She sort of drops that um, as uh, as you say that. Okay, so you know what a deep is. Um, <laughs> Not a deep, but yes, uh, I've become familiar in my past couple of weeks. Kai puts sure. his hand Hansi. up and he's just like, so. Hansi just kind of like picks up the notebook and hands it back to her like, oh, you, you dropped this, here you go. <laughs> Thank you so much, Hansi. She gives you a little pat on the head. <laughs> she gets really excited. Okay, so you're Hansi. Um, I'm Charlie, by the way, and he pulls, like, reaches a hand out. Uh, she pulls up her sleeve and reaches her hand out and you see she has claws and her her hand is kind of like darkened at the, like at the tips of her fingers, and almost her entire hand is like black. Like... She takes your hand and shakes it. I see. Um, I completely forgot that you're supposed to be a destroyer of the universe. That's interesting. Um... She nods. Yeah, well, it sounds like it sounds like you are too, Mister God Slayer. What are you What, what, what are you going on about? Oh, fuck you, Emma. Okay, clearly, <laughs> clearly, there's a problem with gods here. Okay, that must be the only explanation. I'm I'm I am so confident that I'm not fucking destroying the universe. Okay, don't fucking start with me about that. Okay, no. Okay. She watches them oh. like a kid watching it, uh, their parents fight. Or argue. Oh. Ariel, Ariel took note of that she's supposed to destroy 
the universe, and now she's more sus about her. Among us. <laughs> Charlie looks at Ariel and is like, uh, Ariel, uh, Emma says she's good. I trust her for some reason. And then he looks back at her and is like, why do you... Why do you have like super empath powers? What what do you like? I I, I don't know. Why are you unkillable? What, what do you what, what do you, why are you asking me because, these questions? <laughs> uh, well, do you have anything on why I'm unkillable? Like Obviously, I've been looking for that. If I had something, I'm sure I could have told you by now. Oh my goodness. So you're <sighs> Why did you Okay. So you left, okay, okay, you left okay, me okay. in the middle of nowhere with no information, nothing to go by, so I could <sighs> run into a city that I had no idea about, and then you fucking call, then when I call you back, and you say you have information, you bring a fucking, you, you, you drop a fucking bomb on me, I, that you I have said... super, no, I'm not done, you have super psychic powers, <laughs> you have the destroyer of the universe in your house. Listen. Uh, Oversimplification, first off. Second off, I said specifically that this might relate to what you were saying. I just don't know specifically how I'm supposed to handle this one on my own. I figured, one, again, I'm so sorry about ditching you a couple weeks ago, but like, bro, if you understood the... I'm sure you understand the the amount of turmoil going on in your own head, you crazy little man. I am, I am I'm perfectly fine. I have no idea uh -huh. what you to hold on. And he goes into the bathroom because he's about to cry. Oh, <laughs> that's what he called out. Aww. Baby, I stares at Hansi and is just like, so like, are those eyes real? <laughs> she gets shifty eyes again, and she's like, uh, uh, yeah, yeah? Do you want more cake? She just shows. She starts rummaging through her XLL backpack and, like, takes out another container of cake. XLL <laughs> pack backpack? Yeah. XLL stuffy backpack. Yeah. Uh, Charlie, Charlie, hey, like, is in the toilet for, like, five minutes, just, like, collecting himself, and then he comes out, and he's like, Okay. Uh, you see uh, tears that have formed in, in Emma's eyes. Is it, like... <sighs> oh. Okay. Oh, what? How... I under I understand. I'm sorry, sis. I. Did you pull yourself? It's been a lot. Oh wait. Oh, I'm sorry. I don't want to interrupt. Uh, sub meme. Uh, uh, Subs. Paladin just kind of sub to me, and I I got shocked. Paladin! Good job, Paladin. Thank Keep you. it going. Thank Sub you, more. Paladin. You are a sweetie. It, 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 Charlie just walks up to his sister. He's like, I'm sorry, sis. I know it's it's been a lot. and I appreciate that you met up with us again. Or me again. Guys, well, I'm going to have to... I, I have to be right back for one second. I'm sorry. Okay. 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 It's okay. Ariel okay. can be eating cake. Ariel, I'm, head cake skills. <laughs> I'm sorry for leaving again. I really am. But like, I I needed to figure this out, and I can't, could not think around you. I'm I'm better with it now. I'm better. I I can handle it more. Um, but it was it was new to me, and I, I, as I'm sure your powers were new to you. I just I, I don't understand everything that's happening, but I've I've heard um, a lot of things uh, in my in my studies, and I, I feel like it's important to share them. And I, I feel like maybe you might have something that you could share with me. Trouble seems to find you. <laughs> is Emma or Bobby? That is, that is very true. Uh, I do have one thing. <laughs> um, we have a Bobby. We have a bub. What, what do you mean? Oh yeah. Oh, you mean like that? Yeah. <laughs> my, my my brain didn't connect it until now. Char Charlie's like, hm, that's very true. Um, well, I do have um, like I said, um, apparently, God Slayer, kind of cool. Um, oh, and also I have um, I have this one. He pulls out 
his original relic. He's like, uh, and this one, and he pulls out the second one. Like, um, she looks at those and goes, huh. Yeah, didn't know I was a dual wielder, but I mean, uh, and he kind of twirls them like, um, like pistols. Oh. And like, Hello, I'm okay. back. Do with what I have. What did I, have? What um, did I need? Emma's yeah, Bobby. Charlie, Charlie and Emma reconciled, and Emma's your Bobby, essentially. Yeah. Um, oh, Bobby, okay. Um, Did we get anything more on uh, on uh, what this clown girl is? Not yet. We haven't gotten anywhere more than Charlie told her about the God Slayer thing, and he pulled out both his swords and twirled them like uh, revolvers. <laughs> oh, cool. Okay. Um, Emma, Emma goes, ah, uh -huh, okay. Um, so I don't know if you are aware, but our family name does have a legacy. Um, I'm, pr I'm somewhat aware, but, uh, before I got more information, the person kind of lost an arm and went into a coma. So all I know <laughs> oh, is, true. all I, all I know is that, um, we, um, by the way, um, sorry, I just thought about it. Uh, the Wendigo thing, definitely true. Okay. It fucking Wendi hurts. You you fought a Wendigo. Yeah, a Wendigo. Um, they do, they do, they do cut through blades. Um, and he kind of points at his scar. It's like, not fucking. That's fun. crazy. Yeah, I really thought that was an exaggeration. Uh, sorry, never mind. Um, I know we're like our family name are like we're controversial hunters, and we uh some hunters hunt us. I know that. Uh, that was the general gist. Uh, but nothing more. Yeah, um, I've found some interesting things uh, about us specifically. Um, our name is uh, a curse, um, like a curse word, not like a magic curse. Um, I see. For, for hunters, that goes back hundreds of years. Um, apparently, we used some pretty, or our, our forefathers, I guess, used some pretty saucy methods uh, of hunting um, among us among us uh you play <laughs> <laughs> distracting sorry um but but yeah our, our, our ancestors... both, both emma and charlie just a <laughs> massive adhd <laughs> <laughs> yeah it's genetic um um kai but yeah, smiled uh, a um... little bit at the fact that she said that <laughs> Um, but yeah, uh, we, we apparently have some, some pretty weird stuff in our bloodline. Um, yeah. congrats on that, I guess. Uh, yeah, I mean, uh, was, I guess. He pulls up a fist, like, yay. Um, I am very interested in you, though, as she faces over to Kai. Um... Mm -hmm. You're of the deep? Uh, I guess. You guess. We had a combo with him, through him, so I would say they're, they're like, sharing a noggin right now. <laughs> kind of like Ariel, but kind of not like Ariel. Okay. Oh yeah, uh, angels right possess now. people. Um, don't get shocked about that. Uh, no, I know. Yeah. Okay. I got really shocked about that. That's fair. Uh, I'm sorry, Mia. What did you say? Um, she just said she is not here right now. Yeah, that's another problem. Uh, we can't find her original person. She's like disappearing or something. Uh -huh. Um. Um, I've never heard about possessions, like, overtaking hosts, but, um, is that possible? Um, well, I mean, anything's possible, really, um, except for Bigfoot. Yeah. Bigfoot's not real. <laughs> um, do you but, think, but, um... <laughs> do you think vampires do count every... No, I'm getting confused again, sorry. Do, well, that is a good question. Uh, sorry, you, you, you're, do you know of the others? Obviously, you've met the Deep. 
we met the deep. I think the other one was like the unfamiliar, the the, the, the I don't know. Oh, his name. the uncanny, the stranger. Yeah. Um. He uh, he name dropped me. Uh. And kind of uh, stole a person's soul. And uh, oh. that, that was the last thing we did. Um. Kind of. Ooh. Yeah. Um. Not the, our best moment, but um. We're working on it. Gonna get that soul back in there. You know. Okay. Um. Yikes. Big yikes. Um. That's what I'd say. What I I'd call that not good. Um. Yeah, you should have a soul. I don't. Yeah. Like... Oh gosh. Um. She looks back over at you, Kai, and then, like, just kind of stares at you for a second, uh, and you see her shiver. Um. And then uh, she just goes, "Oh, I'm sorry." Yeah, I'm used to it. Uh, okay. Um. Okay. Well, there are lots of other entities. Um. Uh. What, what, what do I know? What do I know? Um. We got. We got the deep. Uh. We got. Uh. The end. The eyes. The filth. Uh. Hatred. Which. Uh. Uh. Hansy points over at you. Uh. I think that's what you were supposed to be from. Which is why I'm so confused. I'm so conf. Why are you so nice? <laughs> Um, She's like, I, I'm a, I'm a clown. I can okay. juggle. Okay. No. Okay. Um, uh, hunger, which, uh, yeah, uh, stranger you've met, juggling is cool. and and the vast. Uh, so those are those are sort of the big ones. Um, okay. Um, and so are they all gods or are they not gods or like what are? Okay, they? so that's. That's a big thing in the in the forums. Uh, people are are. Wait, you've been on Reddit? That's no, not Reddit, you idiot. What, why would I go on Reddit? Hey. Reddit's full of. Listen, okay, sorry, that was harsh. Um, <laughs> um, What's Reddit? Reddit? <laughs> <laughs> uh, Reddit? Reddit's uh, basically a place where a bunch of really mean, stupid people who are smart in very specific areas come on and uh, talk to each other and bully each other all the time. Uh, I, of course, have been using the deep web. Sense. Wait, deep web? Charlie Jenny. <laughs> uh, no, she points at Kai. Charlie meets <laughs> Hansi's eye. Uh, Charlie meets Hansi's look and just looks really concerned. <laughs> <laughs> um, uh, she looks at the confusion that has now taken over the room, and she goes, uh, 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 "It's it's it's." The underground internet, black market internet. It. Um, do, uh, she looks oh, over at okay. you, uh, Ariel, and goes, "Do you do you know what what the internet is?" We showed her Facebook. Know. I do know the Facebook. Okay. Um. Uh, while she was explaining the um. I have the, no the, idea what Facebook listing is. Listing the, the names of the entity, um, Ariel. I I will say that the Bible that you were given, um. <laughs> two mysteries ago, uh, starts to glow out of, uh, out of, uh, yo, for a, um, it's in Kai's bag. It's in Kai's bag. Okay. So, uh, the, the Bible that you got a couple mysteries ago, start to glow out of Kai's backpack. You see a light. Uh, Emma goes, what is that? <laughs> that is my Bible. Why do you, why How did you know Bible it was your glowing? Bible? <laughs> I can. I just know. Okay. You can sense your Bible. Is you that an angel sense power? It. Sensing Bible. <laughs> oh my God! Angel sent she Bibles. Knows. Sh Charlie she knows like, where every Bible is. Charlie, 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 Charlie turns I mean, to him and like, calls? "Fuck it." Hmm? Yeah, sure. I think that's funny. <laughs> oh my God! <laughs> is it? Charlie turns to Emma. I was like, Listen, "Do you have a beer? I can't." She walks. She he, walks like, into walks... a room. Sorry, I was, uh, I was just thinking. Uh, Ariel walks into a room and she's like, there's no Bible here, this place is sin. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Is it like how Hansi yeah, senses uh, birthday parties? parties? Yeah. <laughs> oh my god, Hansi senses! <laughs> Hansi senses, senses when there's a birthday party happening. Um, but when, you, when you ask the question, uh, she doesn't look at you, uh, Charlie, she just goes kitchen and points. Um... Charlie just um, walks into the kitchen and grabs like a six pack and walks out with it, like shrugging too at the same time. Okay. Um, 
she she looks over at you and goes, "Can I take a look at that Bible if you don't mind?" Uh, I don't mind. Um, she walks up to you, Kai, and goes, "Please." <laughs> oh, because it's in your bag. Right. He take he takes his bag off and like unzips it and like hands the book to her. Um, she opens it up and uh, she flips to the page where the light is emanating from um, and you can see it's somewhere in the middle of the Bible. Um, part of the scriptures are being um, uh, like written like written away. Um, the words are like glowing and coming off of the page and new words are glowing and being written down. Um, and uh, as you as you look at it and you read what the thing is, um, you see... Um, the name of uh, of the Wendigo. You see the Wendigo show up on here, um, and uh, it essentially is writing um, the uh, the tale of how you killed the Wendigo, um, and uh, and how how you how you fought the museum, um, uh, and it it'll, it shows all of the uh, the weaknesses that you figured out along the way. Um, and mechanically, essentially, what I'm doing is I'm giving you guys a monstery for every monster you kill. Um, well, for the New Testament. Yeah. <laughs> um, but uh, you see, you see, Emma, Emma looks at this uh, and looks back at you, and then goes, "Where did you get this book?" Um, I want to check out my eating chips. Ariel goes to swallow the rest of her cake. <laughs> she remembers she has to swallow. <laughs> okay. Uh, did we get it from like a... No. That. If I remember That's correctly, what she you got meant. from the librarian guy, right? Yeah. The yeah, the guy who owns the bookstore. There was a kind li librarian man that gave it to me. Interesting. Um, he said I so, should have it. Okay. Um, okay. All right. Okay. Um, she sort of just slowly hands it back to you uh, and goes, you can, you can hold on to that. Um, not a, not your typical Bible, I'll say. Uh, good luck with that. Um, as I was saying, uh, where were we? What was it? We had questions. Surely, Who had questions? Surely, surely had in this in between this. Surely finished the six pack and like got another six pack and it's like about to finish that one. I realized that because I'm immortal, I have the I can't sicken. Yep, uh, you are so immune to uh, getting drunk. Surely, surely can't get drunk, and he's just like very confused, like shugging more. Like I don't think this is. Um, I, I think you got like alcohol free beer or something this is not <laughs> working and then like have you considered the problem is you <laughs> um man have you gotten sick since you man i haven't gotten thing. i haven't gotten sick since i was like i think in his head is just like idiots don't catch colds fancy is i the beer when you say that, uh, Emil actually laughs out loud. Charlie, <laughs> when he says what? When he says it in his head, uh, idiots don't catch colds. Oh, cool. Charlie's like, why? Wait, okay. Um, uh, sorry, no, it's just it's. Uh, I've thought of a inside joke. Um, uh, it's just. Uh, I, I think you. I think you might be. Uh, supernaturally inclined. This is. This might be your curse. Uh, sorry, bud. <laughs> so I, I cannot Inside die, but I can't so get drunk. I don't know if by an awful equals... existence. Yeah, I don't, I don't think this is worth it. Drinking <laughs> is a sin, after all. Oh my God, is that Have you read why? the book? Have you read? It's not. <laughs> Wait, it's not. Oh. No. Oh. That, it it's used an, it's to an be excess. It used. To, it. Okay. Um. Well, that's fair. You probably would know. Maybe I'm wrong. I, that was sort of arrogant of me. You literally come from... All right. That's that's on me. That no, what? You know what? That's on me. <laughs> um, 
Where are we? I feel like we've run on a great tangent here. Hans is get more it's beer, but it does not beer. work. Um, okay. Um, so, gods, right? Um, there's a bunch of them. They're kind of gods. Um, yeah, um, uh, kind of not really. So, uh, I like to call them entities, but um, it's just a strenuous term. Um, it's like just beings that are sort of the embodiment of these things that happen in our world. Um, fear, uh, hate, love, hunger. They're concepts. Yeah, uh, embodiments of those. Um, I see. Um, so if you would, they would be pretty immortal then, right? If you kill one, you kill the concept, so you would have to destroy an idea. So, so the thing is, it's very iffy about if anyone has done that or not. I mean, it the would be assumption, hard to the, the assumption is that is that either either you killed the concept and it's gone forever and just no one experiences that anymore, or the mass amounts of people who do experience that still will sort of come together with their willpower to create a new one accidentally. Huh. That's the theory, at least. Um, big into into theories. Um, does anyone else have, have questions? I know Charlie and I have that whole brother sister thing, but like, if if you guys th feel free, the floor is open. Uh, I can, I'll answer what I know. Um, Hans is have... now busy because she yoinked a a beer and she is now drinking it. <laughs> she, every time she takes a sip, she makes a face of disgust and then continues. <laughs> it makes her feel funny. Char Charlie's, Charlie's like, it turns to her and is like, you know, if you, if you just like, um, if you just like really focus while like shrugging it in, it won't taste of that. You, you I... also don't have to drink that. It's really okay. Kai... She starts chugging it. <laughs> Kai like takes a tentacle and like picks up a beer and like the, the tentacle just chugs the beer. <laughs> Yeah, okay. Feel yeah, like that makes feels sense. Like she should also try. So. Uh, Charlie's like, whatever, you guys has get she had a drink. Yet? Someone has to, and then Charlie walks away. Uh, uh, has, Ariel had, has Ariel had not, a drink yet? Not a bit. I'm sure you had right? water. She has? Water, I think but you've not, had water, but I'm, yeah, I don't think you've had a bevy. bevy. I thought okay. drinking used to be a sin. Uh, otherwise, she would be confused on how to drink and she would yeah, like shoot water. What the fuck? You said drinking was a sin. No, She's like you're pressured. <laughs> you know, like, well, you clarified that it wasn't anymore. But, mm -hmm. Yeah, to an angel, they would know the Bible like written in their skull or something. I'd like to we imagine that's true. So, do you do, do you? I was gonna say, do you, do you drink it? Um, and then what were you going to say? He's conflicted. Okay. Um, she, um, she puts it back down after sniffing it. Hansi slowly reaches over, staring in intensely at Ariel to see if she, she'll she stop her or not. She, she wants the beer. If she will stop her? Yeah, it's yeah is she gonna beer. stop her from taking the beer? <laughs> oh. They're you just having a staring contest. <laughs> she, she's like, she's like, she has a lot of dog tendencies, so she's like, <laughs> you know how a dog stares at you to see if you're gonna stop them from, like, eating something? <laughs> she's, she knows that she might, she might get in trouble, but she wants it anyway. I'm um, so very not surprised that she has dog tendencies. He lets her have it. She snags it and starts drinking. <laughs> also chugging it. She feels terrible, but also good at the same time, so she's just chugging it. Early is um, laying on the sofa, kind of depressed that everyone can get drunk but him. <laughs> not Ariel. 
Well, wait, Ari Ari hasn't tried it. So. No, she probably can't. <laughs> uh, Unless she's like Castiel and drinks an entire liquor store. Yeah. <laughs> Well, we don't know. We we don't know because we can uh, let you reach your lowest, your lowest first. <laughs> yeah, but surely, surely, like Leicester depressed about that, and then turns to um, Emma, like yeah, again, and is like, okay, um, so, uh, let's let's try to organize our thoughts. Um, so you we we have a weird blood i am a god slayer these entities are bad but not really gods kind of concepts uh they sent mi mrs hans over there to uh, <laughs> destroy the world but she's really nice um, yeah she doesn't seem too keen on it <laughs> kai, kai, kai kai like looks at her and says are you married what what's up What's a married? It's a food, I think, Charlie says, and then, like, he has, like, he pulls out a Dragon Ball, like, manga that he knows that, like, uh, Emma would, like, bring with her. I, I just assumed that she had it on, like, the, the bench or something. Okay. I'm forcing you to add this in, Hall, sometime. That's fine. No, that's, you can say, that's fine. It's your sister, you can add canon. Is it a good food? Uh, she kind of steps in and goes, "It's not. It's not a food. It's uh, it's when when uh, it's it's a union between two people uh, who are in love uh, and they want to make sure that's like recognized by the law and stuff for tax benefits and things." Um, Charlie, Charlie, goes, that that's, Charlie, Charlie stands up like that's wrong. Look, I have evidence, and he uh, like po okay. points at a point in uh, in uh, the Dragon Ball manga. Uh, and goes like, see? And it's like Goku going, isn't that a food? Because like he mentions that's, it in... That's not... Okay. Okay. Um, all right. Charlie, Charlie smirks at Emma because he knows that Hansi would believe him. <laughs> Hansi is enthralled by this manga and starts reaching out for it because she wants to look at pretty pictures. He, he gives it to her and then he goes, start from here. And he pulls like to the first page. She, uh, while you guys are, are, while you guys are, are looking through these uh, through the mangas, um, Ariel, you are sitting there um, and you begin to get a ringing in your ear and you feel a desire to go outside. Okay, she stands up and walks outside. Um, uh, in the middle of this of this commotion, uh, Ariel walking outside, your your ears uh, ring more and more and more until it sort of like comes into like like a tune like like it's like you're trying to find a radio station um and you finally connect metal to one. detector <laughs> <laughs> um uh, as as you stand out in the middle of this cornfield um you you hear like a ariel 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 can you hear me yes i i can hear you uh you would recognize this voice uh, to be your brother uh Azrael angel oh. of death Oh, Asriel. Um, that's yep. That's that's his name. <laughs> Undertale stole it from the Bible. <laughs> Wait, really? No, Ariel. Ariel is saying his name. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. I thought you. Were just I, I know he's an angel. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, but uh, Asriel goes. Um, <laughs> um, Asriel goes. Um, Ariel, it's getting crazy up here. I've been trying to reach you like three separate times. I, were you? I guess you were connect disconnected. Maybe, maybe he was preventing me from getting to you. I, I don't know what's oh. happening, but I think Seth is is like he's taking over. I, I, he, I, he's been lying to us. He's been, and then uh, the signal cuts out. <gasps> dun, dun, dun. Ariel is like Astral, Astral. Oh no. And, uh, uh... <laughs> uh... Did anyone have any reaction to Ariel just sort of getting up and walking outside? <laughs> Charlie, Charlie noted it and then, like, uh, went back to, um, like, discussing stuff with Emma. Okay. Uh, if she's taking Hansi too likes long the to... Manga. If, if she takes too long to Ty's go, tentacles like, come back in, beer. Charlie would, uh, <laughs> like, walk out to check on her. Ariel is thinking on what to do. 
she considers uh, that she needs to go to heaven and check it out. She also considers that her mission is that she needs to stay here and protect Charlie. Um, She's very but... considerate. <laughs> but she understands that you are relatively safe right now. And she cares about her family. Okay, well, bye, Ariel. I... <laughs> No, she's going to walk in. Okay. She's going to walk in and tell them. So she walks back in. What do if you tell they them? Noticed. Uh, she's like, I have to go. Um, okay, why? Um, my brother asked for my help. Something is wrong. In heaven. Uh, I have to oh, go. Okay. Um, what's gonna happen to Annie if you leave right now? She, the, since she's no longer in the body, I assume it will go into a, a comatose-like state. Um. I do not know where she is. Emma, do you think we can, like, do something to? Preserve, her, like, uh, her check on Emma, as so she doesn't just like die. I, I, I mean, I can see what I can do. I've never dealt with this before. Yeah, um, that's that's fair. Um, I, I Kai, will be back. Kai stops for a second. He's like, um, that kid didn't have a soul, and they were still operational. Yeah, but this is more like everything is gone, right? Not like uh, just the soul. Is everything like, gone? There's no presence if you, like... Isn't that what you said, Ariel? Uh, there is a trace of her. Okay, well... I, I can't focus on this right now. She's not here and I need to go to heaven. My family needs me, and well, you guys are are safe, right? You guys are you're not going into danger. No, but are you gonna be safe if you just go to heaven now? Especially if it's like if things are happening in heaven. I need to know what's happening. Well, can you promise me to be safe? Ariel, I, I need you to promise me. My family wouldn't hurt me. Okay. Well, we'll take care of Annie. Just don't do anything dumb. And she goes. Uh, what you guys see, uh, especially Kai, since you have the sight here, um, you see this sort of, like, glowing form, uh, attempt to fly out of, uh, Annie's mouth and eyes, um, as it begins to, to shoot up into, into the sky. Um, it is about to phase through the ceiling above, above where she is, um, when all of a sudden, uh, there is this, like, loud, like, clap as if, like, there was, uh, a, a sonic boom, um, and you see her sucked back into the body, and she hits the ground with a thud. Um, as Ariel, you are incapable of leaving Annie in this moment. Well, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Charlie, I, like, uh, runs up and is like, Ar Ariel, you okay? I can't leave. I don't know what's going on. Uh, okay, that's not good. Um, uh, is Charlie, there any... yeah, I'm scared. Um, <laughs> Emma sort of butts in uh, and goes, "Okay, so it looks like we're all having a pretty rough day today." Um, but from the looks of it, it doesn't seem like there's much we can do about it right now. 
and I'm very, very sorry about that. And I'm, I understand there's a lot of stuff happening for you, a lot of stuff happening for us as well. And it's as I've as I've come to grow and believe um, in times like this where there's nothing you can do, don't do anything. Instead, do what you can. Um, it looks like you seem pretty haggard. Um, I, I'm sure we're all in, in, in need of some rest. Um, uh, maybe maybe some practice, some training. Uh, maybe we can get a, a better hold of our, our abilities and whatever. Um, but most of all, I know I haven't been to... And pardon me for, for suggesting this in such a time, but I haven't been to a mall in some time. Have you guys been... <laughs> I, this sounds ridiculous, but um, there's a great there's a great boba spot in there. Um, it'll we we just need Shelly to regroup. Just starts okay. Starts laughing. Shelly just starts laughing. He's like, <laughs> How? I, you, you keep it up, don't you? Says. Listen, listen. Hey, when there's nothing you can do, do what you can. All right. Kai, Kai, so, Kai actually puts his hand up and is like, "What's boba?" Oh, okay. What's a, that's what's it. A mall? We're everyone going. get in the everyone get in the truck. Let's go. Charlie, Charlie, Charlie's in full agreement, and uh, he's like, "Everyone, let's go." And then he turns to Ariel as like everyone is leaving. Is like, "It's gonna be fine. It's just uh, we gotta give this. We gotta. We have to. I don't know." And then he leaves. <laughs> Ariel isn't very reassured. Charlie, Charlie doesn't know what to do. He's kind of like. But she just follows. <laughs> She's going to be very quiet from now on. Um. So yeah, you you all hop into the truck. Uh, who sits in the in the front with Emma? Charlie. Charlie. Okay. Um, I was laying down in the the back like always. <laughs> Actually, will, would Hansi have sit in the... Cause, no, uh, she likes sitting in the back because air. She likes... Okay. She likes... Sticking her head out the window. <laughs> yeah, but there is no window, so she just sits there. <laughs> Ariel uh, is also fun. sitting there, and she's just going to try to connect to the angel radio. So you see her kind of like, looking like she's like... And this Focusing is really hard. <laughs> um, Charlie, actually, is... you know what, uh, Ariel, give us the first roll. Uh, roll boss from beyond for me, since you're trying to do that. Whoa! Ooh, yeah. yeah. But I can actually roll that. Hold up. She rolling. Okay. You see her rolling. That dice are shaking. Fuck. <laughs> huh. Okay. Um well, that's fitting. Um uh you are trying to tune into this uh you do gain experience. You're trying to tune into this sort of angel radio, push your way back in. Um and what you connect to is Seth uh or Se Seraph. I, I said the wrong name before. Um it's Okay, who, I, uh, I assumed. <laughs> Yeah, uh, Seraph, who who connects to you, uh, and he goes, disregard all former messages and stay put. Oh you my have God. a mission. Uh, and then hangs up. <laughs> She's even more distressed than she keeps trying to, like... Um, like, she lets out, like, a frustrated, like, ugh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, so you, you have... Can trouble uh, all the way as you try to connect all the way to the mall. All the way, keep on um, dancing. The entire time, you... Hansi was just staring at Kai because he looks familiar. Shirley is, um, Shirley is massive researching on uh, possessions and like um, uh, the functionality of that. Uh, roll me investigate a mystery for that. Great. I didn't want to interrupt you, uh, Hansi. Hansi was staring at Kai. Yeah, because he, he looks familiar. familiar. Kai is lying down asleep. <laughs> staring at him so intensely uh, right now. Just investigating mystery, right? Yeah. Yeah. I hope I pressed the right one. Now. I find it cute. He asked her if she's married. Oh! oh. 
Mm-hmm. He asked her if she's married because um, Oryx said Mrs. Uh, Hansi or something oh. like that. Yeah, I was so like, he's like Are you it's married? very out of character for Kai to flirt <laughs> like that. That's, that's, Man, that's literally why he asked. Oh my god. You want to, be, to, be, to be fair, the first, the first mystery, Kai was kind of just like... like uh, oh yeah, no, he, he is smooth. Super, like, that is sm- smooth. Yeah. If you have something <laughs> that interests him, uh, this, this, this goes back to one of his eclectics. Um, like, punk, punkish hair or like, cool contacts or something. He's like, hmm, cool. And then he gets a little smoother on you. Nice little uh, <laughs> secret you now know about Kai. Nice little little character character thing. Mm-hmm. Um, but yeah, you guys you guys pull into this uh, mall parking lot. It's uh, relatively like normal uh, traffic flow. It's not crazy busy, um, but uh, there are there are a couple people uh, coming in and out. That's a burger place. And ah. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, you you, uh, you you pull the parking lot. Um, no uh, disdain towards and, me is what I live for. Uh, and uh, Charlie, throughout your your car car trip, uh, what were you specifically looking up uh, about possession? Um, it was um, uh, like um, uh, a, a angel possession, uh, per, and like. Uh, um, pers- possessy trapped um, and uh, 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 like um, uh, uh, locking uh, or like um, uh, trapping spirits or uh, all traps. trapping spirits yeah a lot of traps um, sure so let, we'll say for the sake of this that um, uh, Emma gave you her phone so that you can use the the, the dark web forum uh, that she was a part of um, to try Charlie, and... Charlie was on his flip phone writing it she was just like come on <laughs> yeah <laughs> she was like get, 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 come on get, go with the program uh, and hands you her, her smartphone um, <laughs> um, and she uh, gets she gives that to you as you search these things um, uh, and you find uh, things about like um, the the mixing of powers uh, and uh, close to close to death um, encounters, um, all being sort of things that can sort of uh, build a, a form of like trauma bond with with the uh, host and the inhabitor, wow. um, as well as well as um, uh, sort of like create this sort of uh, loss of no. uh, essentially what, what you've what you've come to understand is that the most likely uh, thing that's happening to Ariel right now is that Annie uh, has like been sort of like locked behind a trauma wall in her own brain um, and Ariel is sort of taken over as a, as a fight or flight response um, uh, Ariel is incapable of leaving right now because that trauma block um, is physically connected to her um, and that is what you have sort of uh, come to understand right now Charlie Charlie turns to Ariel as soon as they get out of the car, and he jumps up to her and is like, I know what's happening. What? You're a What is happening? (laughs) You remember how bad things got uh, in the museum? Yes. Yeah, so you were fine, but for Ariel, for, for Annie, you, she was experiencing all of the pain, right? Because she feels the pain. Unfortunately, yes. Basically, um, when when a possessee um, goes, like, experiences a close-to-death encounter, um, the mind might shatter and uh, go into a, like, a trauma state where basically... Um, Possessor um, gets full control, but also becomes incapable of leaving. Uh, you're basically just like a firewall right now, and you can't stop partaking because the host is incapable of dealing without you. However, that means that if we can solve the trauma situation with Annie, she will be fine and you can leave um, for the angel business. <laughs> 
probably saying this, and uh, you can imagine basically the like uh, me des- describing my Steven Universe fanfic, you know, like the <laughs> that meme, like that's basically what Charlie's doing while he's explaining it for Ariel. Meanwhile, um, Hansy. <laughs> <laughs> He's sleeping, um, so she's like, can I do this? <laughs> yes, she can. Did I... cast this? Uh... I mean, no, not you. That would have been the giant fat bear. Um... Yes, but... She would not go through this if it wasn't for... Um, you can see that Emma sort of butts in as she was eavesdropping, and she goes, well, technically, she wouldn't really be this if it wasn't for Charlie, and it wouldn't be as Charlie's fault either, because uh, Charlie's sort of, sort of circumstance was uh, not really his control either. So technically, it's no one's fault. Huh? Damn right, sis. Up top. <laughs> and they do, like, uh, they do, like, a, a handshake. <laughs> they do, like, a Sam and Dean handshake. Okay. Maybe, That's maybe I should should never have listened to Seraphine. Listen, how, Ariel, how could you have you, known? Yeah, Ariel, Maybe. this is like your entire, like, you said it yourself. You care a lot about family, right? You family. got this mission, and you had no reason to doubt it. He is doing something to the angels. Yeah, and you got manipulated. That's not your fault. You don't blame a victim for, like, getting victimized. Right? You wouldn't blame Eric. You wouldn't blame blame Annie for like saying yes to you, and you wouldn't blame yourself for being manipulated by the F, F the programmer or Seth whatever. Rogan. Not not to say that you manipulated Annie, just to make that clear. No, 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 no. You didn't definitely did not manipulate Annie. Um, you got manipulated uh, into asking Annie for a favor. Uh, that favor just happened to be really bad, and you did not know that because you got manipulated. Um, you're the main victim here. Charlie, Charlie yes. looks really, really like proud with that explanation and turns to Emma to see if that was a good job or not. Like a little She gives brother. a thumbs up. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Char- Charlie's really happy with himself. I just don't know what to do. Well, um, and then, we'll... uh, Emma puts an the... arm around you, uh, and goes, I know what we'll do. We'll get some boba and everything will be okay. <laughs> yeah, the important thing is we know we know what it is. That's the first step. And well, the second step is trauma. Well, it's oh, no. a very it's a very good part of removing trauma. Let's go, guys. And Charlie jumps off the car and starts um running in the wrong direction. Um <laughs> Uh, Emma's gonna take one of the hacky sacks off of uh, Kai's face and then throw it at you and go, wrong way! <laughs> Charlie just 180s and keeps running. <laughs> uh, Hansi will go uh, fetch her uh, thrown hacky sack. <laughs> um, uh, Emma will, will slap Kai in the leg a couple times and go, come on, buddy. <laughs> All of the hacky sacks fall off his face. <laughs> no, actually, as he gets up, he sees the hacky sacks are in his face, and he slowly moves them on top of his head and just, like, tries to balance them. <laughs> as he gets Yo! That um, makes only... her very happy. Is there, like, Frisk yeah. with, the, with the hot dogs? Yes, exactly, like Frisk with the hot dogs. Please please roll me uh, Act Under Pressure, just because I think this is funny. Fuck yeah! <laughs> <laughs> I'm dying. Uh. Oh, no. This is probably the funniest episode we've had. We're just like constantly memeing right now. <laughs> and this is pretty serious for Ariel. <laughs> yeah, Ariel's having like a horrible time. <laughs> this is the most eventful thing for Hansi. <laughs> it's, it's, it's like the super, it's like the meme we were going to do in the beginning with like uh, Kai. Um, you, you guys remember like the TikTok meme I was going to do? Like the, mm-hmm. yeah, it's like that, but that's Ariel and stuff. Nice. Mixed success. Okay, um, I'm gonna say that that plays out like, um, you get all of these hacky sacks up on the top of your head, um, and you all see Kai sort of like, uh, wobbling to try and get to, uh, inside the mall, um, but when you reach the door, you realize you have too many hacky sacks stacked up and you wouldn't be able to fit through the door. (laughs) Kai Kai just stands there and stares at the door, like, you, you lit, you can, you can physically see 
an ellipsis just go across his face. Charlie, <laughs> Charlie walks over, and he's gonna try to attempt to take half of the hacky sacks. Put him on his own head. You, you, you look over at Emma, and you see that same exact look in her eyes. <laughs> Hansi is just excited that everyone is uh, enjoying the hacky sex. <laughs> should, I, should I roll for doing it? Um, uh, Kai, would you stop him? Would you try to stop him? No. Okay, then you can just do it. You, you knock off half of the, the hacky sex. No, 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 I put them on my own head. Oh, oh, I see. Yes, I'm roll helping. under pressure. I, I, I'm gonna, Charlie's gonna help Kai, because they're best friends. <laughs> I thought you were trying to, like, slap down the tower. You see, <laughs> okay, you, you go to reach for, um, for this, this, um, Mark experience. stack of towers. Yeah, uh, sure. You, you go to reach for this stack of towers, um, and, uh, Emma, Emma goes, nope, and jumps up and slaps them down <laughs> off, off of Kai's head. <laughs> I is like, saddened um, by how this uh, plays out, but you don't see. And she's also saddened. Wait, wait, they're all of them down. Uh, uh, she she slapped off the top half. Okay, Charlie goes ah, and he slaps like the rest of them. <laughs> <laughs> Hansi is double saddened by this. I can't believe she can't believe they slapped they slapped her hacky sacks like that. The absolute disrespect. She starts picking them off the floor. Charlie sees all all troopy. Charlie sees this, and he picks up, like, one, and he puts it on her head and walks away. What's Ariel doing? Ariel's just staring at them. We're doing all of this in a mall, by the way. We're probably, like, the <laughs> Yeah, there are, there are a couple people who are, like, looking at you, and you can see, like, a couple of them are, like, looking kind of, like, like head-cocked at Hansi. Um, oh, yeah, because uh, she's then... freakish. <laughs> uh, but it's then you see, like Emma, sort of just like walk in front of the the view, uh, and they're just like shake their head and walk away. Um... Charlie's like, uh, okay, uh, now where to? Uh... First order of business, uh, Boba makes everyone happy. Everything's good about Boba. Um, come over here, uh, and she'll lead you over to this little like kiosk uh, in the middle of the mall. Um, where it's just like these uh, two employees uh, working this boba stand. Um, you can see there are a bunch of different flavors and whatnot. Um, and they're like, hi, how can we help you? Boba, boba please. What the fuck is boba? Uh, they, they like sort of look at each other and they're like, just like any, any flavors or... Uh, and then you guys order your boba based on flavors. I won't. I won't spend time on this. You get. You get boba. It's good. It's yummy. It's boba. Um, I'd say Ariel, if you if you get boba, you're probably confused about the both the action of trying to drink and chew something. Um, yeah. Um, but uh, you all have this. It, it tastes it, very good. Hmm? He does it to try to get the trauma away. <laughs> I, I, I would <laughs> chew out your trauma. I would assume that Charlie and Emma spent like five minutes annoying them going boba and not answering their <laughs> questions <laughs> that is canon now they, they yeah. look very exhausted by the time you leave uh congratulations I, uh, you've you've harassed employees <laughs> at a food station this, yeah. is, this, is like, this is like extremely dangerous having charlie and his other like sibling <laughs> too much power is in this like siblings should we have a picture of a mall on the screen uh, yeah, I this just didn't is the grab mall. one. This it's... is the mall. <laughs> Boba. Um, um, but yeah, you, you guys are now uh, walking around the uh, the mall, um, and then uh, uh, Emma sort of looks at you, looks at you all, and he goes, "You all look kind of worse for wear. Does anyone want to check out any of the clothing stores or anything?" I'm not getting rid of these. Like these are perfect for me. Hansi has no idea what she's talking about. <laughs> Um, uh, Ariel's not she, concerned about clothes. Uh, she she looks around at you guys and goes, "I think it's time. I think I think first first step we gotta we gotta forget about our problems. Everything's fine. We we got we we're, we're just, we need to we need to take our mind off things. Okay, we just need to get to a place where we can work on working on ourselves. You know, let's Jim let's... and Charlie like uh, grabs. Uh... Ariel's like, come on, Ariel, this is the perfect way to get rid of trauma. And Charlie just runs, uh, like, in the direction of, like, where he thinks a gym will be. 
and uh, okay. he, he, and as he's running, he'll be like, "Whenever you're gonna deal with pain, just mask it behind muscle." And he keeps running. Uh, okay. Emma calls out, uh, "No, no, okay." Um, well, that's Aerial where they follows, went. Um, I guess. Can I, are we? I guess we're, are we following them? Kai, Kai just says, "Does this place have an arcade?" Uh, yeah, I I believe so. Um, we're on the corner over there. I should probably check. Kai on walks them. around you... the corner just after she says that immediately. Um, uh, Hansi, do you want to stick with Kai real quick? Yeah, yeah she is intrigued like arcade. because arcade. <laughs> she immediately grabs him and starts running around the mall trying to find an arcade. Uh, you guys find one relatively quickly. Um, it's the shipping time. Sorry. <laughs> I don't. I personally don't know of too many malls that have gyms in them, but for this sake, I will say there is one in this mall. Um, yeah, we'll like a superplex mall. We have it in Sweden. We have like basically every fucking mall has like a like dumb gym. They're like it's not even a good gym. It's just like gym where like dude bros go and like shoulder muscles and like they have like a. Yeah, they have bro. Like a shitty he- they have like a shitty heavy bag for like assholes that don't know how to box to show how bad they are at boxing while pretending they're good at boxing. So I would assume like that like they would have one of those. And like obviously sure. has a gripe with these walls. I fucking hate like those. <laughs> things, okay, they're really stupid. Uh, you walk in and there are a bunch of like buff individuals. Uh, rather rather cut. Some of them are rather large. Um. Uh, working out on various machines, um, and there is uh, a punching bag uh, in the far back corner of the room, um, and you can see that there is like a group of people sort of surrounding that, um, uh, like sort of cheering on this this one guy in the middle that you can't see. He walks over and is like, uh, "Fellas, <laughs> uh, you yeah. mind uh, scadooting? Uh I think we want to use it, and surely we'll use." Um... Um, uh, manipulate someone to um, uh, be like a bigger dude bro than them and get them to leave. Okay. Um, mixed success. Okay. Um, you see uh, from from this like crowd a really like buff like taller than you guy like sort of walks up to you with like this sort of scowl on his face and he goes, "Hey, listen, man. Um, I understand you want to use uh, you want to use the equipment and all that." Forth. Um, listen, buddy. I wasn't asking. Uh, uh, he goes, Whoa. "All right, oh. champ. Um, I I understand I you might be it. a little bit of the aggressive type, and that's cool and all. However, there's gym etiquette. You could wait like a minute or two. He's he's only got two reps, man. Chill out." <laughs> oh really? Oh sorry. And then he like lets go of his throat. Oh, he just banging uh, an asshole. Kind of just like rubs his neck, and he goes, "Jeez, all right." Uh. For some okay. reason, I thought you said grab some. Well, you've never been like you've never been in a jersey gym. Charlie is bullshitting now. He feels embarrassed. <laughs> ah, uh, fucking guy, like, Jesus! Turns around again. Cry, hello. You good, Cor? I got yeah, hit in the Raiders. face with everything. Oh, hi, Raiders. Hello. Raid Shadow Legends. Raid Yo, Shadow Legends. what's up? Currently, our superheroes are in a are in a gym. <laughs> well, <laughs> well, half of them are. A, a, a dude, bro, because he wanted the boxing back. Uh, thank you for the raid, Angel Raid. Hell yeah! Angel Raid, Angel Raid. I the shout uh, out didn't go off, so I'm gonna do it myself. Yeah, I'm, I'm doing it. Mia's doing it. Angel Raid, Angel uh, Raid, what? Angel Raid. Is it not like that? Shout out! I'm trying to use a new shout out command. As a shout out command? New shout out command? Yeah. But. This one. But the video. You can do both. Mm. Uh, this one make like it's easier for people to just follow them right away. Ah, uh, that's nice. I'm still gonna. No, I don't think so. There we go. Okay, cool. Try that though. Yeah, someone's who sneezed in the background. Holy crap! Yeah, yeah, that's Overwatch. So... Me. That's my brother. Oh, more like Underwatch. That was loud. <laughs> 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 Away. What the oh fuck? my god. Okay. Those people are watching it. <laughs> okay, we're good. We all good? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed Overwatch. Uh, yep. 
the heart appears at the top of the chart so people won't have to navigate away. Ah, hmm. poggers. That's really cool. That's nice. Okay. But yeah, Charlie. Charlie goes like, "What? You've never been in a jersey gym?" Trying to like think of like a like a way to save face. Is it? Uh... Um, he, the, the guy kind of turns around, uh, and goes, oh, oh, are you still talking to me? My bad. I'm sorry, dude, I already turned around. Um, this, we're not in Jersey, dude. No, sorry, just got the etiquette mixed up. Oh, okay. Yeah, no, no big, man. Just, uh, man, I don't want to go to a gym in Jersey. You guys are crazy. Uh, <laughs> no, we, anyways. We fucking, we fucking fight in there. It's like we're going to a bar. Oh my bar. god, he's just going to keep talking. Oh, for huh? real? I, I never, never really left the state. That's pretty crazy. Yeah, um, uh, recommendation, uh, if yeah. you're going to go, pick some, uh, pick some good padding for, for your gloves and, uh, don't leave your, don't leave your, like, don't leave your machine. Thank you for the hydrate and the stretch. Uh, Definitely don't leave your machine. And Charlie, right, thanks, like, bro. yeah, no problem, dude. And Charlie turns to Ariel and is like, okay, note to self, uh, dude bros are super nice. And I was <laughs> Why would they not be? Um, I haven't actually been in like a gym that wasn't a boxing gym. And the guy that had that gym was really old school. And we just beat the shit out of each other every day. Oh. Every day, yeah. bro. Um, you can see that the, the cheering has sort of started to die down a little bit. Um, and this uh, crowd sort of splits apart. Uh, and this person who is uh, in the middle hitting these, these punching bags um, uh, comes out. And it's this, like, really small, scrawny kid. Um, and he's like, hey, what's up, man? I heard you wanted uh, next on the, the boxing, the, the punching bag? Uh, yeah, we wanted to give it a few... Yeah, all right, yeah. Sorry I took so long. I was just trying to finish up. Um, and he, like, wipes sweat off his face, and he, like, takes a drink of his water. It's all yours now, man. I, uh, if you want, I can clean it off first, or... No, it's 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 all good. It's a goal. Sorry for the hassle. Hope you had a good... Yeah, it's... Yeah, thanks. Um, all right. <laughs> and then he walks away. <laughs> Char Charlie, Char Charlie feels so bad. He's like, oh, yeah. Uh... <laughs> Charlie, 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 like reiterates, like, okay, don't fuck with Jim Bros because they're really nice. <laughs> <laughs> but, but Charlie, Charlie's like, okay, Ariel, listen, we gotta get that trauma out of you. Super yes. easy one way to do it is by Bunch. aggression. I'm gonna stand here, and he walks behind a bag and he holds it, and he's like, and you're just gonna fucking slam this, like, Bag, yeah. Punch Will the bag. that help? Will that help me remove the trauma? Well, you, uh, maybe we'll try. Um, basically, um, try to connect with Annie and uh, let her uh, get some of those feelings out, or you Die. get your feelings out. <laughs> Should One I roll? I'll let you roll uh, tough or act under pressure, or tough or cool, whichever one you prefer to, to roll. Tough or cool. I guess I should roll tough for this one because, you know, physical force. Mm hmm. Um, okay, she tries to focus on Annie and her emotions. Did I do it? Oh. Oh, good. Um, uh, so what you what you feel uh, is well. First off, uh, this like crowd that was formed around this little kid um, that is beginning to disperse. They see uh, like one one of them sees like you two like get behind this thing, and then they're all like, um, uh, they all like kind of freeze up and like sort of like like, like like stop what they're doing and like turn back to sort of look look what happens. Um, and you channel this sort of like uh negative energy that you have uh like sort of blocking any in um uh and you you feel the the like the rage of not being able to to help your your family um and you you feels, sorry she also feels the rage about the the whole uh, uh yeah that thing that mm -hmm. angel not being truthful with her about what's going on like yeah. open with her this whole swarm of emotions sort of flows through you. Um, 
as uh, Charlie, you see uh, her eyebrows furrow, uh, and there's like a slight glow coming from behind her eyelids uh, through her eyelashes, uh, which you which you spot very easily because you're used to this at this point. But you're pretty sure that no one else has spotted, um, and you can see uh, an actual like <sighs> of like of like l- like glowing air sort of come out of her. Um, and she just does this one singular punch into this punching bag. Yeah. Um, and her fist goes through the punching bag <laughs> and into your stomach. And it's a good oh. thing that you are who you are. <laughs> um, um, and you see like the faces of everyone in the gym, like just sort of like shot, like in shock. And then they all erupt in cheers and they're like, yeah, let's go. Let's go. Let's go just poke the punching bag. Charlie picks her up. It's like, yeah, that's the spirit. <laughs> you see sand I... spilling out of the bag. Charlie's <laughs> like, Charlie's like, do you feel better? Uh, she, she's like asking Annie, like, Annie, did that help? Are you here? Um, it certainly felt cathartic, um, and she's not as far away. You've, you've certainly located where the trauma block is, but, um, you do not have access to her. I feel closer. Okay, I have a perfect idea. I broke Um, it. Uh, hey, dude, bro, uh, sorry about the neck thing again. Uh... Do you guys have like a ring? Uh, uh, no, not in here. But I know of a gym, uh, like around the corner, uh, a couple, a couple buildings away. Um, that one can sweet. work. Sweet, thanks, man. Uh, yeah. Um, uh, do we need to like? Do you guys have more of those, or should we move them or something? The 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 punching bag. Yeah, like. Uh, uh, yeah, I got, I'll, I'll ask Tim. I'm sure he's got more in the back. So you, you don't, you don't need to worry. That was sick, dude. That was absolutely, he, he looks at you, Ariel, and he goes, bro, that was absolutely sick. Up top. Give me, give me five, dude. And he puts his uh, hand up. She remembers, this sparks the memory of doing the f- give me five before. So she doesn't. Um, you give him a high five and it sort of pushes his hand back a little bit and he goes, wow, you really do got a kicker on you, huh? Nice, man. Yeah, uh, but yeah, someone else will, will take care of that. No worries. Uh, that was when probably he the says, highlight of our day. <laughs> when he says you have a kicker, she's like, I have trauma. Uh, he goes, all right, listen, man, I, I get you 100%. We all got some bad things that happened to us and we all got to work through that. And really, it's okay. Like, uh the more the more like bad things that happen to you in life the more like you can get work like work down but honestly you just got to keep pushing forward honestly like uh don't let it don't let it bring you down like i understand things can get tough sometimes and that's perfectly okay it's okay to have negative feelings all right man Uh, he sort of like puts his hand on your shoulder and he goes listen i out of all people my dad horrible person bad mean to me my mom Mm -hmm. out of out of my life now so no worries but like i understand it's really okay it's like you will work through it, and things do get better, man. It's all good. I understand. Anyways, have a good one. And he walks away. Charlie is crying. Thank you. <laughs> that actually helped me a little bit. Oh. Um, and with that, we're going to cut back over to... Um, uh, <laughs> we're gonna cut back over to um uh hansy and kai in the arcade i want to know what you guys are up to <laughs> um well hansy is probably playing like racing games and absolutely flooring it getting really excitedly competitive it's just she just wants all of the little, little tickets <laughs> <laughs> Wasting all of her birthday birthday party money <laughs> on, the, <laughs> on the arcades. Is it wasted if you're having a good time? Exactly. True. This is dragging um, Kai around. Kai, what are you? Are you? Kai, wrecking these. What are you doing? Kai is um on uh, the machine next to the racing as she's racing. Uh, it's like this, like you know, the little shoot at uh, the, the little gun machines. Um, yeah, and the yeah. theme of it is like shooting like Cthulian entities. <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> no pimp, 
pent up aggression at all, no. <laughs> <laughs> None at all, no. No underlying issues here. Yeah, this this is not a relation to anything that Kai is personally dealing with. This is just for fun. Kai <laughs> just randomly goes, take that, dad. <laughs> <laughs> You're not my real dad. <laughs> Um, I, I will, um, I will say I'd like both of you to, um, roll me act under pressure with advantage. Uh, so roll two and take the higher result. Cause I know you both mentioned being good at, uh, mm. arcade games in your like previous things. <laughs> okay. Now I have to learn how to roll things. <laughs> um, so if you open your character sheet by going to the journal, um, I should have already placed it in your inventory. Uh, you just double click on Hansy. Um, Wait, is advantage just like a forward? You just click twice. Huh? Did you say a food? A <laughs> forward. A forward. Oh, forward. No, no. It's a. It, this is a. Uh, this is a, 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 a homebrew mechanic. I'm stealing from Dungeons and Dragons. Okay, how do I do it? Oh, I click twice. You click. Yep, yeah, because it just rolls it twice, and then we'll take the higher result. Okay. Try again. Wow. Okay. Mark experience. Um, I, I got experience um, from that. Sweet. <laughs> deep, deep is just not allowing it. Uh, um, and I want to say I was I'll, doing well at that. first, and then he kicks. Yeah. He, he like kicks over on it. I start shooting the humans. <laughs> That's fine. Yeah. Um, I will find it one day. Yeah, I was gonna say if you if you click on your hunter moves references here, um, then oh, after the first shit. one at the top, and you can just click on the dice. Uh, it's de default, right? Yeah, and then just do it again. One more. I will. I will learn. I swear. <laughs> what do I do with the zero? <laughs> Hmm? Yeah. Big success. Okay. Yeah. Um, so Han Hansi, Hansi is uh, dealing a lot better than uh, Kai is right now. Um, Kai, you start you start doing really good in the very beginning, um, but then you sort of feel like uh, the deep being disgruntled with how how you're shooting so many, like kind of like jealous. Um, and then you start shooting the people instead, uh, and then you do very bad for the rest of the time. Um, um, and then you look over to uh, Hansi who is like doing pretty bad at first. Uh, you can tell she's never played this game before, um, but then uh, immediately she like sort of has this like connection to it um, where she then like gets better and better and is racing like a, like a pro um, and absolutely kills it and gets a lot of tickets from the machine. Amazing. She's like cradling all of her tickets. <laughs> Very excited. She can't wait for the prize. <laughs> she probably like uh takes all of her like cradles all of her tickets and starts shoving it uh, onto kai just giving him <laughs> giving him all of the tickets because she genuinely just wants to play the game she's not interested in uh kai takes the, the tickets and goes to the much. prize counter <laughs> sure she uh, just follows you, you bring it to the the front desk uh with your um the puppy girl following you um and uh and you go up to the the guy at the front counter, and he goes, "Halloween comes early this year, huh? Uh, anyways, uh, what can I uh, what can I do you for? I see you got some tickets. We we got we got candy. Uh, we got those like st slip st 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 sticky hands, the stretch. Um, okay, game master. Uh, what so what actually is at the counter? <laughs> yeah, he's explaining it. Um. <laughs> Oh, like actually, uh, he, I thought he'd do a, like a half-ass job. No, well, he he is, but like I'm I'm also using him to tell you what's there. Um, okay. He's he doesn't really care to be there, but he has to tell you by if to get paid. So. Um. All right, go for it. Uh, you got the the sticky slap hands, the slime ones. You know, um, you got little spider rings. You got some some stuffed animals. Um. Uh, I don't think you have enough tickets for it, but we got a Nintendo Switch. That one's like 4,500 tickets at least. What is this kind of arcade? 
<laughs> Listen, dude, you gotta get you gotta get crazy tickets up in here. Uh, not many people get that many tickets. I don't think I've ever seen one of these leave. Kai <laughs> sees this as a challenge, and he goes back to the arcade machines. <laughs> Um, Hansi just follows, chanting, Arcade! 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 <laughs> He's is, just gonna play more arcades. This is how Kai's gonna upgrade from phone games. <laughs> he gets a Switch because they played so many he's arcades. Gonna, he's gonna bring the entire machine thing with him. Um, wait, I, if you have, uh, if you'd like to try and find, like, um, um, uh, a role that or like a move that you have to like make you better at this game either of you if you have something like that oh yeah because we can rig like, it uh yeah forcibly like like even if you if it's like tangentially related and you think of something feel free to we can we can shoot more <laughs> it in I well i'm in corporal, <laughs> corporal? Oh, oh my gosh um i'm trying to think what, what what would be good for that one um probably physical games oh like that those one you know those those games where there's like the the coin towers and you have to put in quarters until the thing falls down <laughs> uh. i i'll say you can you can probably do one of those um <laughs> that's really i funny. think hansi can probably win at the, like the punching uh like oh yeah because she can literally throw super heavy objects, she can probably win up. We're teaming up things. to get Kai a switch. Let's fucking go. Yeah. <laughs> We're getting Kai a switch. Uh, you guys use your your various supernatural abilities to sort of rig these games, um, and then uh, you come back with sort of an ungodly amount of tickets uh, as you walk up to this counter, and he goes, "Dude, it's only been like five minutes. How did you do that?" <laughs> Mm. Uh, uh, Hansi slaps her like biceps, uh, and she just goes, "These babies." <laughs> Kai doesn't wear glasses, he goes, but he put he, he like he presses his nose as if he was wearing glasses. <laughs> he just goes, All right, I don't get paid enough. Um, uh, give me the tickets, and uh, I'm assuming you want the switch. I know. Uh, sure, I'll take that as a yes. Okay. Um, <laughs> um, he he like takes your tickets uh, and just sort of like feeds them into a ticket eater. Um, it has one of those like sound effects on it where it's like. Ow, 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 ow. Oh, I love those. Ow, ow, those are my favorite. <laughs> um, uh, and he he pulls out this box of Nintendo. This box that has like a Nintendo Switch on it, and it's got like this sort of um, uh, like like uh. You know those like things where it's like if you walk out of the store, it'll set off an alarm. It's got one of those on it. Hmm. Um, he sort of rips that off uh, with with a thing on the on the front desk, uh, and he hands it to you. And he goes, "All right, now I'll, I'll let you know. There's nothing in here, but it's a it's a it's like a redeem this. Uh, you get a Nintendo Switch on our website. Uh, you can scan the QR code on the wall over here. Um, good luck, dude. Uh, my boss is gonna be pissed about this one." <laughs> 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 mm. The entire time, uh, Hansi is just on her tiptoes, leaning over the counter and just like going up and down, excited because they won something. <laughs> I turns to Hansi and like motions to a high five. Well, like he she, just she he just keeps a, the hand there. <laughs> she gives him a high five, but it might be a little bit too aggressive. Oh, that's fine. Yeah, it, it like pushes your hand back a little bit. Yeah. No, actually, it, it it slaps the hand but goes through it a little. <laughs> <laughs> Too much impact. Um, that is the uh, first he, time he kind of just like that. looks at this and he goes, "Did you just like what happened to your hand, man?" <laughs> and then he takes a puff out of his vape. Uh, <laughs> he goes, yeah, whatever, dude. Uh, my head hurts, kind of. Uh, <laughs> Can you can you get out? I don't think legally I can have you in here anymore after you got the switch. <laughs> <laughs> Kai scans the QR code and because uh, you know he's a nerd, so he he like gets everything redeemed and uh like games it to be as soon as possible. Um, what address do you send the switch to? That is true. Um, 
Where does could, what, we've been cruising with um, what's her name, Emma? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, we basically like we basically like crashed at Emma's. So like that's yeah. So he puts Emma's room. place on. Again, he made it as soon as possible. All right. Um, so you do that uh, as you guys walk out. Um, I'm going to cut back over to uh, Ariel and Charlie. Uh, as you guys are beginning to walk out, Emma finally catches up to you. Um, and she goes, oh, there you guys are. Uh, where are you going? Where? What's up? You guys, you hit the gym? Is that fun? You guys have a good time? Where? Uh, what's up? We what's hit the, plan the gym, now? we destroyed a bag, and now, because that oh. worked, we're going to go to a boxing gym. And Box. we're you guys are like this. super powered, right? Maybe, yeah. maybe um, you shouldn't. No, no, no. We're not going to destroy gonna more we're not equipment. Gonna box. You hear whistling in the distance. We are going to box. <laughs> and Charlie points at Ariel and then points at himself. And then uh, and she goes, that's, "That's what I'm saying." And then uh, Char uh, uh, Kai and and uh, uh, Hansi walk up at this moment. They meet up with you guys. Um, and you, you see Kai's holding this. Are you still holding the box for the empty uh, the empty box of the Nintendo Switch? <laughs> yeah, he doesn't know what to do with it. So it's just like, okay. he's, he waves um, with she, the box, she, like casually. Uh, she's like, she, she, Emma, Emma looks at, at Charlie and goes, that's what I'm saying. You guys are so powerful. What if you destroy more? Is that a Nintendo? Do you think that has Animal Crossing on it? He turns around. And he gets completely infatuated with the switch, and he's like, "What?" <laughs> yeah. he has we no clue what a switch is. Uh, we want a switch, but this is kind of empty. I gotta wait for it. For it's, uh, in Charlie grabs uh, Kyle <laughs> as best as he can with his like face through, right? And he's like, "We're getting Dark Souls." <laughs> is Dark Souls on the switch? Yeah. Yeah, no, that's I'm awesome. On the do 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 Kai do Kai meet Charlie's request or Kai Kai's just like sure. Charlie is so happy he tries to hug Kai. You and, see like, Kai walk him. into uh he tries to hug Kai and like he Kai faces for you. And uh you uh, see the box him walk... also falls out of your hand. Yeah. He Kai's already got the order in, so um <laughs> Uh, you see Kai walk uh, into a tech shop. <laughs> okay. Um, I'll, I'll say, do you want it to be uh, like a Microsoft store or like an Apple store or like a Do like they a sell SIM shack? cards? Like what? SIM cards? Um, you, so you, you might want like an AT&T or like a Verizon. Uh, no, like, um, sorry, uh, micro SD cards. I got confused. Oh, micro SD cards. Um, yeah, I'll, we can say there's like a Radio Shack. Okay, uh, it's, I have it's no idea what that is, but I'm assuming it's an American it's, business. It's a, it's a really old, almost out of business, uh, like tech store. Uh, cool. In, in America, it still exists in the Midwest. Kai Kai walks in and like he just grabs um, like the highest memory SD uh, he could find. Which is surprisingly a lot nowadays. Have you seen how fucking high those yeah. go now? Jesus <laughs> <Christ>. <laughs> stuff. That's crazy. Um, <laughs> yeah, he grabs that. He puts it over the counter and like takes buys <clears throat> buys one. Um, the uh, person at the at the front desk there goes, "Oh, hi there. Uh, I see you want their uh, SD card, then, yeah." Yeah. Oh, uh, doing doing some some photography then? No. What you what you up to? Games. Oh, gaming! A little gamer. My my uh, my son likes to game. <laughs> cool. Uh, so this this one uh, uh, will run you up about a uh, about uh, one one hundred and seventy U.S. dollars dollarinos. Uh, one terabyte SD card. Uh, pretty pricey, if I say so. But uh, eh, who who what am I to know? Uh okay. Because got, this is uh, for money. Um, Kai says, "Be right back." Um, uh, alrighty then. C catch you later. I'll just hold on to this for you. Uh, he walks <laughs> up to Emma and is like, "Can I borrow some cash?" She goes, "What? Why? What? For what? How much?" Uh, he calculates. So, did you say a hundred and what? 
170. I much? looked it up on, on Google right now to see how much a terab one terabyte SD card was. Okay. Um, <laughs> uh, 40. Someone minus 170 from, four, like, 44 from 170. I'm lazy. Okay. 44 from 120 something. 120 something. I, 126. Okay, I need 126 bucks. That's that's a lot of money for is me for specifically. Kai's like that's a good point. Is it for the switch? I, yes. Charlie puts oh, okay. all of his money into Kai's hand. It's like, how much money? <laughs> Take my money. Go and do. Go and be great. I have 44 dollars. I need 127 more. You got 69 from Charlie. No, I probably has no money. Uh, how much you got now? You had 44 plus 69, that is 100 So you need 57. Uh, 57. She goes, all right, that's that's manageable. Uh, and she pulls out her wallet and gives you 57 in cash. Uh, why everyone carries cash here, no one really knows, but that's fine. Um, uh, she gives you 57 cash uh, and says, this, this, you better know what you're doing. <laughs> <laughs> Kai walks back to the counter guy and is like, he just plops the money oh, on the counter. There? Oh, wow, we, you, you got that pretty quickly. Uh, hopefully you didn't rob nobody. <laughs> Anyways. Um, in in yeah, Kai's head, it, um, I know none of you can hear it, but in Kai's head, it's, it's, he just thinks, that was plan B. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, well, Ariel can hear that. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Ariel, yeah, Ariel has as the as the telepathic. I forgot about that. But um, but well, yeah, she, she goes, just oh, hear she's... everything all the time. Bring that no, up. No, she you. can't. But she could hear it. Yeah, if she if she if was she listening. She wanted to yeah. look. Yeah. You have a one terabyte SD card now. Nice. He puts it in his bag. I'm glad this was a plot point. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Kai comes back to see your group, uh, and Emma goes, right, what I was saying, um, I, I think it might be a little bit dangerous if you two were to fight in, like, an open space, considering how powerful you guys are. Maybe, just hear me out, it might be a better idea to, uh, if you guys are gonna spar, like, do it in the cornfield near my house? Okay, fair I don't enough. I um, understand why we are going to fight. I'm not supposed Ariel, to fight you. Ariel, you're gonna punch your trauma out of you. But I'm supposed to protect you. Yeah, but I you cannot hurt me. Like, <laughs> look at me. You do have a point. Yeah. I, I also, just... you need, I need to, like, you know, you're pretty good at fighting. We could probably, like, you know, teach each other some stuff, you know. <laughs> I'm pretty good. You know, I did boxing. I'm, huh, I would say I'm a pretty, I'm a pretty talented guy. Uh, we could get some stuff done. He lost yeah. every fight in the second grade. <laughs> <laughs> that is true, but he did actually get some boxing training. Yeah, he, you, you're, you've, you've improved, <laughs> certainly. Yeah. But, but yeah, Emma just so... has to say that. <laughs> Wait, did Emma say that? Oh, that's yes. perfect. Sure, yeah. Surely... Surely, surely, surely does the like the Stewie like uh, Stewie like head tilt turns to her and he goes, <laughs> he goes. I did a lot of boxing after that. <laughs> uh huh. Uh huh. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Anyways, shut up, Emma. You never did boxing, okay? And then he runs. And look off. how I turned out perfectly. And she takes a sip of her boba. <laughs> Kai, Kai just says Emma's the guy in the chair. <laughs> Thank you, thank you so much. You understand my worth. If you're not <laughs> quiet, we're gonna spar, and that's not gonna be nice. What, no what? need to be rude. Did, did wait? Did Charlie say that to Emma or Kai? Charlie said that to Kai because Charlie gets upset that like everyone is bullying. Like he, Kai, he, he doesn't deal with people. Kai, Kai, Kai just is great. Kai says back. I mean, you can try to hit me, but I don't think you can. Okay, can we talk about that? It's not supposed to be like you can ignore harm. Like it's no, specifically... not not in actual yeah. fights, but it wouldn't be an actual yeah. fight because the only time we have fights yeah. is like with monsters also, and stuff. It, it also like it also specifically 
I mean, it's, it, obviously it's like yeah, Hall's, Hall's rules, but the, the this move itself does specifically point out that you're not We've also to be been able doing face, face through people. Yeah, we've been doing that wrong. I just realized. Yeah, it, it literally <sighs> you're not supposed fun. to be able to do that. It, it is for fun, yeah. But like through, I, this, I say this, through <laughs> through people when it's funny is good, but yeah. um Which, they can catch uh, you off guard. Be. They can a, they can uh, uh, um yeah. A, a, a non-serious could... fight would be fun. Right, a serious yeah. fight. I would want to be able to hit Kai, but yeah, but we would never fight, do a so... serious fight. That's the yeah, thing. That's yeah. why he Maybe. said that. Um, I think, I think personally, uh, like if, if you were like, if we rolled like a like a a fail, failure on a KSA roll or something, we can rule it like you punch through him because he was expecting it or something like that. But or we'll cross that bridge when we get to like it. If, <laughs> or like if one of us like get possessed, and we have to have a fight in like some arena death game thing. Like then we would want to have yeah. a serious fight. But like as a meme, I'm, like as a meme, I don't mind it. I think it's funny, but I do want to bring it up because I haven't like. I feel like we need to acknowledge it at some point. <laughs> I haven't been um, doing it seriously for a reason. Like I, I only yeah. whenever I'm serious yeah. with it, I only go for objects. Yeah. No, I know. I, I'm not. I'm not accusing you of anything. I, I just wanted to like, uh, point it out. Like, uh, have it said, I guess, or whatever. Um. But yeah, Char Charlie gets uh, upset by that, and he goes like. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> All right, everyone. Okay, uh, is there anything else anyone else wants to do at the mall before we head home? If you guys want to wander around, um... Kai, Kai just says, "Is there any way we can win money?" Um, <laughs> is there a bar? Not, um... not here. Not in the mall. The mall's sort of like a family-friendly place. You don't have any. So there's no, machines. not really gambling. Not really. No, there's an arcade that you like, but I'm. It looks Wait, like really? you've been you there. You don't have um, any slot machines in like your malls. That's weird. Malls are family friendly places. Yeah, yeah, I don't think they they have a heavy uh, have culture any, of gambling in public malls. In Britain, in Britain, you get slot Sorry. machines like everywhere. Yeah, but Sorry. you guys are built different. You just gamble like normally. Surely, surely, surely like... turns to surely turns to Kai uh, and like kind of puts his hand through him, and he goes, so how much can you control that? Control what? Hey, uh, Emma, do we have any, um, um, uh, what are you called, bank, bank machines? ATM? Uh, yeah, do you have any ATM machines nearby? Uh, um, somewhere. Hi? You want to yeah. get some money? I'm poor, so yes. Let's go, I Marlin. Think... <laughs> Charlie, yeah, okay. Charlie, Charlie, kind of, Charlie just kind of like gently like tries to like get get like a slight grip, and he kind of just like nudges him to follow him, and then he lets go and like lets Kai decide on his own as he like looks for an ATM. Kai just wants money. He doesn't know what you're doing. He just wants money, so he follows you. Um, if we do, yeah, do we find an ETM? <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, you could. I'll say you could find one out, uh, outside of the mall. Um, there's one. Uh, it is underneath the security camera, as they typically are. But uh, there it is. Charlie's like, okay. Um, hey, uh, by the way, your tentacles are are they visible on like camera and stuff? No, not to perceptive eyes. Great and. Charlie, Charlie kind of like does like the most like uh, uh, sneaky like. Would you mind destroying that? And like, like kind of does that like. Uh, he's like talking and throwing around his hands uh, while like also pointing at it, like trying to be discreet okay. but also like. So Kai, to... Kai out uh, out of sight of the um, the hidden camera, because again, tech boy. Um, you he... can't be out of sight of a camera when you are at an ATM. No, he's not. Yeah, we're standing the right there. Yeah, no, he's 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 in the like because it's got a curvature. He'd be at a blind slot. Uh, like he's away. From... So the tentacles are long, right? Oh, yeah, the I tentacles see. Are I see. Long. You're not standing in front of. You're just like reaching over with your tentacle. I get you. Yeah, he's he's out of sight of the camera, and he reaches over with the tentacle, and he short circuits the tentacle. Uh, the camera. Um, I don't think you have an ability to short circuit. I think that, you can yeah, he's, he's really literally smashing smash. it. That's what he's doing. He's okay, short circuiting okay. it by smashing it. 
I'd say you don't even have to roll for that. Uh, it's a stationary object, and you have tentacles. So you uh, rip this arm. camera. Yeah, it ignores and you, armor, so yeah. You, you rip this camera out of the wall and drop it on the ground. Neat. I was like, perfect. Uh, step one. Step two. Uh, <laughs> money making. And Charlie is on lookout. Um, uh, Charlie is probably, like, unironically kind of done this before. <laughs> so uh, Charlie's on lookout, making sure that no one one like uh, sees it as Kai is taking the money. So Kai slides his hand through like the slot and um, forces it through all the little, like the, uh, as much money as he can bundle uh, um, through like all the little holes and you know like the machinery and like slides it all through and then pulls it forcibly out of the um, the thingy. What's it called? Are you locking your hand in the machine? Because you can't grab the money if you're incorp incorporeal. Uh, he's not. He's not. Um, so like his arm is incorporeal. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, like, but his he, he, I... he takes his hand like physically. He's trying to like make it so part of him is incorporeal and other part isn't. Mm -hmm. So then your hand gets stuck on the machine and you can't pull the money out. I don't no. I don't understand what you're trying to do here. Um is um so the way I thought, uh, thought of it was like the fingers specifically like he solidifies his like pinching like his what's it called index uh index finger and thumb and pinches like a bunch of money. He doesn't know what he's grabbing. He hasn't looked inside. He's just grabbed a bunch of money. Um, okay, so essentially what you're, what you're doing is you're trying to force the money to come out of the slot one by one? Yes. Okay. Um, well, first off, uh, this would take a very long time. Second off, uh, and people are coming and going, so you don't have too much time unless you want to get called the police on. Um, I, I would argue so that, like... No, sorry. I don't want to interrupt. I'm sorry. I'm being stupid. I was just going to say, say, second off, you're, I don't, I don't know. I, I don't know if ATM machines are different in, in England, but in, in America, your fingers are not like they're too thick for you to go in the slot. So you wouldn't be able to really pull it out. Um, and then thirdly, uh, I think it might count as trying to break the machine if money is being yanked out without it being dispensed. And that would activate the ink that would then spray over the, the money, making it useless because they'd be marked bills. I would, so, like, there, there is a mechanism, right, that, like, pushes the money out, right? So I would just yeah. assume, I would just assume that, like, Kai would, like, shove his hand in to, like, like, a free space, and, like, he would kind of, like, press it, so, like, the money would, like, start flowing, like, he would move the mechanisms. That was... I would say you need to give me a, a sharp roll minus, minus one to do this properly. All right, I'll do my best. Because I don't, I don't think you have uh, the inner working knowledge of an ATM. Really <laughs> not, no. Neat. All right, mixed success. Um, I'll say you can probably get uh, about fifty dollars out um, before you hear a. <laughs> Uh, and then the next dollar that you pull out is a marked bill. Um, and you can see uh, that there are some people who have pulled in the parking lot now and they're about to start coming towards you. They um, uh, wants to... Okay. Uh, Kai, takes, well, so we're, Kai takes we're, the money we're and moving, just walks right? through the wall. Yeah, no uh, perfect. So the, the money doesn't come with you then. You walk through the wall no, and the money falls he, down. <laughs> wait, but the bag, oh, he puts it in his bag. Yeah. Hmm. Also, Kai has clothes on him, like... On that's yeah, level. that's fair. Yeah, nope, yeah, like, nope that's fair. That's how we can it. Kai is, like, I was just like uh, becomes naked. <laughs> yeah, that's fair. I was just like, you're you're holding it, and it's, it's just gonna fall out. Like, uh, usually when he... You have been bringing salt on yeah, so that's fair. When he, wear, when he wears stuff, because that would be... So not cool. Yeah. <laughs> um, all right, well, that's fair. Yeah, you, you walk through the wall with the money. Uh, yeah, we, we all leave them, I guess. 
so you're you're headed back into the mall to meet up with everyone? Yep. Yeah. I know, that's fifty bucks. Money. Yeah. Uh, I actually have more money than I started this with. I thought everyone yeah. I thought everyone came with you guys. Oh, okay. Is that what that, I don't think that was said, but if everyone wants to, we can do that. Um I just assumed. <laughs> I'm sorry. I think it would be way too sus if we're like fifty people or not 50 sorry that's an over exaggeration i know we're not 50 but like yeah. five people yeah i just um, went with um charlie yeah I, I would assume that like you guys would like be at the car or something and we'd be like we'll be right back hansi would have probably helped if, if they took her with them because she has a old, old squishy hand tail well, I think we're working out the like um, our um, money making progress process. We're yeah, usually out we can... Kai works at yeah. places, but we're not here for long. And Kai wanted money yeah. again because he just spent money, and he's like, he doesn't like not having money. Yeah, <laughs> Hansi but, uh, just goes to birthday parties. Yeah, I think nice. I, I think we're all we're all trying to figure out the best way to get money. Like we did the arm wrestling bit for a while. We now we're doing like generally just stealing. And uh, we're probably just going to keep being criminal. <laughs> um, um, so you guys make your way back Ariel, to the Ariel would, Ariel would usually care because stealing is a sin, but right now she's preoccupied. Also, Ariel did not know what we just did, so... Yeah. Yeah, that also. Also, Kai probably threw the, the blacked out the dollar, right? Sure. I'm asking you, Kai. Wait, the black dollar? Yeah, that, that's not mine. I, he'd, yeah. he'd, like, burn it. Yeah. Also, sorry, Hoss, okay. that came off really rude. I didn't mean it in a rude. <laughs> I'm not um, asking you. <laughs> uh, you guys make your way back to the, um... I was already gonna make um, you buy that fool. Back to the car. Um, it's on you guys wishes. make your way back to the car. And as you get into the um, the, fl the flatbed back of the car, um, you see a police car arrives. You, you hear it first with the, with the sirens. Um, and then two cops get out uh, and walk over to the ATM machine. Um, and they just start, like, looking around at it. Do we have to escape? Oh, not we have problem. to leave think they've seen you. <laughs> <laughs> they have no um, idea we were there. We well, actually, actually, I wanna, I wanna, I wanna do a um, oh, no. read a bad situation. Okay. What? Uh, what? Why would you? Okay. Um, well, um, I wanna right. see if they like. Um. Uh, read so seven. Next. I get to ask one question. Uh, right? Yep. Um. What's my well, best way in? Uh, what's my best way out? Are there any dangers we haven't noticed? What's the biggest threat? What's the most what's most vulnerable to me? What's the best way to protect the victims? Can we not also just ask a general question? Or sure. Uh, I was just uh, giving you options that are listed. Yeah. Would would they be sussing us for any reason? It doesn't appear that they would have any reason to be. Um right now they are currently just looking at the ATM. They'd have not looked they have not made eye contact with you. Yeah, so Charlie's like, well, I mean, no reason to worry about us, and then, like, he gets chilling. Like, we're moving into the car, sitting next to his sister, and we're just gonna drive. Alright, uh, she begins to drive you guys home. Uh, back to the... Back to the, the place. <laughs> the house. The, the farmhouse. There it is. Um, as you are... Uh, you drive back. Um, uh, if you don't have any sort of conversation, the the ride sort of passes uneventfully, each uh, sort of struggling with your own inner turmoil and uh, prizes won from that day. I guess you're not struggling with prizes. You're just sort of enjoying them. Um, you uh, make your way back to the house um, and you pull into the, the little offshoot garage room thing again. Um, Emma hops out and goes... Uh, remember, Cornfield's up for grabs if you guys want to fight. Uh, technically, I am squatting here, so uh, try not to make too big of a scene to where you'll get noticed, but, like, go ham. No, I don't think anyone's lived here for a very long time before me. Um, Radio, sis. 
Uh, by the way, uh, do you mind us crashing here when we, like, aren't doing stuff? Because uh, we yeah, don't dude. actually have... Thanks, sis. Charlie gives a super, like, happy, like, endearful in, in smile. And, uh, <laughs> and then uh, he goes, okay, Ariel grabs her, picks her up, and is like, we're gonna get that trauma out of you. And he walks out with her. That's how trauma works. <laughs> gonna beat out the trauma. <laughs> <laughs> Charlie, Charlie puts her down in the, in the like, cornfield. And then he, like, walks, like, walks around and, like, uh, so they're, like, facing each other. And he's like, okay, Ariel. I want you to punch me with all of that emotion. Are you sure? Yes. I guess. Can I start taking popcorn while watching them? <laughs> if you're sure. Absolutely sure. Uh, kick some ass? Sure, yeah. Can I hands, uh, hands your popcorn? <laughs> she takes it. She yeah. starts munching and crunching. She, like she pulls out uh, a container of more cake from her bag. She's <laughs> almost out of cake. cake. She stole a lot of cake. Ooh. Oh, my God. Take some cake. These are some pretty narratively correct roles. She's um, happy for sharing cake. Um, okay, so there's something I've been wanting to try and reconcile here. Ariel does have the ability, um, smite. Your body and weapon always count as a weakness. Um, mm -hmm. Typically, it's against monsters, but I, I'm wondering if it should count against Charlie. <laughs> um, even if it does, it would not do more, like, it would still not hurt me. Um, with um, the with her hands, uh, the sword potentially would hurt me then, but like, that She's would also be like... at you with her sword because she doesn't want to hurt you. Yeah, it would also kind of so... be inconsistent with like what we have established, and it it should be like, if you have a weakness and humans have all weaknesses, Charlie just has less weaknesses. That would That's be my fair, but also humans. she's mostly angel right now. Which is what I was thinking about that, because I know I know we've had her punch you before and it didn't do anything. Uh, yeah, but she also has like st like slashed me with the sword. That's fair too. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, All right. I don't I don't um, think it would like hurt me. Potentially, you could argue maybe this instance because she's so connected and like in like a fight or flight. That's what, that's what I was saying. I think the, maybe. The... Yeah, I, <laughs> I I I think in, in like in like the like. Annie's trauma is like trauma responsing like a fight or flight. Ariel would probably like be able to uh like throw like more power into it. Um yeah. but but it wouldn't do any difference either way for this fight because that would put her damage at three, and that's exactly what Charlie can like mitigate. Yeah. Alright. Well, so you you go to throw punches at, at Charlie, um and uh you are sort of having this sort of sparring combat. Um, is there any, like, conversation you two want to have during this, like, spar fight? Charlie's going, that's it, come on, harder! <laughs> just like, like, Ariel um, is just going like, okay, if you say so. I'm, I'm assuming, like, like sh she is, like, launching Charlie. Have you guys, have you seen like God of War like Balder versus Kratos where he's like hit me harder and it like just launches him through like a tree like it's like that Charlie Charlie gets launched he stands up like you can do better than that and she uppercuts him and stuff. <laughs> yeah, you see uh, from this window, uh, I assume you guys are watching from like a second story window eating popcorn. Um, you you see. Uh, this scene of of Ariel like punching Charlie really hard, and he flies through this corn, like sort of wrecking um, uh, as this corn falls down uh, in a way. Uh, and she like angel wings is up to him like super speed and punches him up in the air. And he's getting like beat around, but he's got this huge smile on his face. He goes, "Yeah, get it out!" Woo! Um, as he's getting knocked around, uh, sort of uh, anime battle esque. Um, uh, and then. Uh, Ariel, I'll say you have made your way in this sort of weird uh, 
sort of like area of punching him around in this in these different ways and you punch him down into the ground for your last hit um and from the window you all can see it looks Ow. like they just made a crop circle um mm -hmm. uh in in this corn because i think that's funny um and as you uh, uh, stand kneeling above him uh right now uh with your fist sort of on his chest um you you uh sort of get a, a reminder of what your initial mission was um, from from Seraph uh, to protect him uh, and to make sure that he can uh, fight and uh, and sort of be good on his own. Um, and then you remember your message from uh, Azrael uh, and you have a little bit of doubt. Because um, mm -hmm. if he's lying and he's the one causing problems for everyone and it does appear to be that way, um, due to the concerning messages you've received. Was he lying to you about the original mission? He was ac I was actually thinking about that before, and I was thinking that Ariel has been conflicted about that in the entire time as well. Yes. Good, good, good. This is perfect. <laughs> um, so this whole thing is going on. Uh, everything's going crazy. Uh, and then Kai, your phone rings. Ring! Or, mm, mm, I don't know if you have your silence on or not. Um, do you pick it up? He checks the number. Uh, it's Sabrina. He picks it up. Oh. Um, you pick up this phone, uh, and she is in hysterics. She's very panicked. Um, and she goes, I don't know what's going on. I, there's, uh, there's some thing here i i don't know what i don't know what's happening it's there's so much i i can't even understand what's oh hey hey kai did you did you call me and that's where we're gonna end the session for now yay <laughs> cool cliffhanger yeah that's really weird. uh i hope you all had had fun and a good little time um it was a it was a pretty chaotic one um if you yeah. have any any complaints or or improvement notes uh be sure to give that to me after stream um i got a switch in 50 bucks i'm happy <laughs> <laughs> they have boba they robbed, they robbed an atm they have cake they oh, beat the shit God. out of each other Ariel got trauma and Ariel got trauma <laughs> Shawnee got Shawnee got the. Hmm, this is getting interesting. I'm getting thrown <laughs> through, like I'm just I'm happy. I wanted my anime moment. Fancy <laughs> got new friends. Yeah. Um, all friends now. I'm gonna say we learned something new and important about the world, so you guys can all mark one experience. Yo! Yeah. I don't know what we learned, but yay! Yeah. Uh, you learned about the about a lot of things actually. Um, oh. About the, the different entities you've learned about, um, oh, uh, specifically what's that. wrong with Ariel right now. Yeah, that's um, fine. Learned you learned about... Special about the, um, Wait, like, doesn't that mean uh, we learned something important from the people, yeah. like our the player yeah, as well? Yeah, two, but two, two things are still uh, only what? one yeah. um, oh, one experience. Yeah, Wait, do I get to mark it down? Yeah. I was, okay. Welcome! This is how you level up. That and rolling bad. <laughs> yeah, I rolled bad today. I got experience points. Great. I, I'm up at three experience from this. Nice. I got one. Um, I'm, well, thank you, everyone, oh, oh. for joining us today. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Hollis is um, great. Hollis You're is great. Amazing. Hollis is yeah, thank you, Hollis. Hollis is Love really you, good Hollis. at this. <laughs> um, who are we gonna raid? Uh, so we have Legends, we have so. our, our new our new uh party member, so they can pick. <gasps> Dan, yeah. Dan Satsu Dan. Then Dan, I love it Dan. Is. Dan. 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 Dan is great. I love him. Dan. Dan. Oh, I should stop recording. Setsu, more like.